Welcome to Zero Page Homebrew. Come on <laughs> in and turn on the lights. The lights won't be adequate enough, but nope. uh, we'll have to adjust them. <laughs> there we go. Yeah. Lights, camera, action. Yes. Yeah, what a show opening. So it's going to be a little bright. We're going to have to adjust some things. <laughs> We're a little backlit right now. Yeah. But how, what do you think? What do you think of the new sign? Ah. And that is LED. Vintage. <laughs> vintage is way too much money and way too delicate. Like vintage, like real neon. Real no. neon. There are some places but that make real neon. But it does look really, really good. The yeah. electricity bill just boop yeah, right up. just spiked for the next two hours. <laughs> no, LED is not that bad, actually. Yeah, no buzzing. Yeah, There's no buzzing. yeah, that wouldn't, that would, yeah. Yeah, I've been working on getting that for months and months and months. Mm. And what better time to unveil it than in during the, the show? In the heat of summer. In the heat of summer <laughs> when we come back from the uh, summer break. So mm -hmm. welcome to Zero Page Homebrew, mm -hmm. your best source for the newest Atari games. And tonight we have four. That includes two world premieres. Mm -hmm. Uh, very, very exciting games to, on tonight's show. I have some cat cam issues here. Oh, oh. Super blurry, super blurry. That. Yeah, I wanted to turn that off so that, uh, come on cat cam. You can do it. It'll sort itself. Oh, out he says, why is the cat cam not working? Maybe I need to look at it. Oh, no, no cat cam. So there you go. Recognize my face? Yeah, that go. worked. Yay! We're going to be playing 2,600 games tonight. Oh. Squish. Oh. Uh, those include Intruders, uh, exclusive world premiere by Leandro Camera, uh, Meow 2 mm -hmm. by uh, Mirsad Saralika. Hey! Welcome! Thank you, Rendered Ghost! Thank you for inviting all your friends <laughs> over, Rendered Ghost. We welcome them. Yes. Hello, hello. Hello. Hi, Miss Nomer. Uh, Heist 2 by Timothy Marsh, and Oh No, More Peril, that's the actual title, by VHZC. Nice. <laughs> so a sequel to Peril. We actually have three sequels tonight. Yes. Meow 2, Heist 2, and yep. Oh No, More Peril. So mm -hmm. chock full of goodness today. Um, and we have some very exciting unboxing, as well as, of course, the sign as well. Yeah. Uh, did the audio cue? Yeah, it did play. Oh, it was muted. It was a little muted. We heard no, it, it, but it was completely. quite muted. We oh, heard was it? it oh, no. But it's muted because oh. I had it muted. Because I'm still uh, upgrading the audio stuff. Yeah, so. and also the sign is so loud. So No, it's not. <laughs> <laughs> Drowning everything out. Yes. Uh, first, I want to thank all the Twitch subscribers scrolling beside mm -hmm. Tanya there. Mm -hmm. uh, Al Nafar, Arkham, Arkham H, Arms Guard, Coder, Atari, Nage 74, Atari H, Beef Supreme, <laughs> B, or Poke Up, Chelsea, Donnie Mel, Charles, Will, and Chitla, Lula, Colonel Lama, Dan, if you see Daryl, Nage 70, Dr. Moo, Cows, Gamma, Dev, Gun, May. Glenn Main, Great Defender, Gradams, Ground Trooper, Johnny WC, Carl G, and Carl G, Ken Jennings, Vader, Feltifer, Lambda Express, Lord DZ, Mark Yannis, Mark Spacing, Mick Muse, Mike Saul, Mike Littell, Mother 3, Mr. Zarn, Whoop, Mr. Fix, Muddy Funster, Nathan, Strum, Neo Media, Nostalgia, Koal, Garcia, 70, Render, Ghost, Apprentice, VG, Ricardo Pim, Six, Sweet Sims, Sledgehammer, Smitty B, Spiceware, Esmer's Teleprompter, DK, Tiki Dan Cage, D, The D Train, Trek MD, Vec, Vexor X, VVG, Double Down, X, Ken X, and just before the show, Miss Command Yay. resub, RC7E resub. Yay. Thank you so much for your awesome. continuing support. Yeah. Feline peril. Yes. No more biting toes. No. Nope. It's almost presentable, my toes. <laughs> almost. <laughs> almost healed. Uh, if you didn't say <laughs> micro machines, then it's not the real thing. No. Yeah. Hello from Brazil. Hello back to Brazil, oh, Victor yes. M. Um, oh, uh, yeah, we're back yeah. from our summer break. It was about two weeks. Yeah. It felt like a month or two months. <laughs> felt like for a long you. time because... Yeah, uh, no streaming for you. So, yeah. No, we did two Hi. after darks. Um, yes. It was, uh, we were sick for most of it, which is probably why it felt very long because yeah. we were doing nothing sitting at home. Yeah, there were a couple um, of days in there of, of a lot of just recuperating. We would have so. done a lot more after darks if yeah. we weren't sick. Yeah. yeah. Oh. Summer colds. Ugh. Yep. I Awful. ordered a new light um, because these lights are not enough to offset this bright thing. Um, we just we got this like a week or so ago. Uh, it comes with a nice control. You may not be able to see the color. You can changing, see it a little bit, yeah. But it's uh, there are some settings. We can change the color of the zero-page homebrew. <laughs> yes. 
which is kind of cool. Um, we can also um, change so it blinks. I don't know if you can see it blinking. It, there's one where we haven't quite figured out the controls, but it will fade in and out. You can change the colors. It also has this like flashing neon sign thing. Um, and you can dim it. So you have to cut it. Oh, there it goes. That's a flashing one. Yeah. Yeah, it's big. <laughs> yeah, it is very big. It's four over four foot wide. Yeah, there is a uh, there's some strobe effects, yeah. but eh, we'll play with it after. Yeah, <laughs> um, I've got a big light that's uh, coming soon, mm. um, and then I will switch from NTSC PAL color scheme. Yeah. yeah, right now it's NTSC. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> uh, okay. Uh, news. Uh, there's five days left in the Atari Age Store sale. Mm -hmm. So if you want to get those games that are disappearing, you definitely need to do it right now because they're going to be uh, gone very soon. Uh, I think there's uh, over 90, 90 games. Mm -hmm. So it's running till this Sunday. So get your orders in before they disappear forever. Oof. Yeah. Um, so if you wanted to get these games, now is the time. There's, I, I don't know how much, how much, 10% off? 10% off. Yes, that's right. Mm -hmm. I ordered the last two I wanted. I ordered four that I, I that from you wanted, yeah. Bob Tech Di Crescenzo. Oh, ordered yeah. Ordered four yeah. of his. Yeah. Um, so, yeah, and I, there's a list of people saying what they ordered mm -hmm. in the forums, and people are getting their orders in. So that's good. That's good, yeah. Um, and my lunar asked, can you change the brightness of it? Yes. Sort of. <laughs> uh, not the lines. We not the lines. We can't change the brightness of the lines, but yeah. we can change the brightness of the letters it's not really going down oh you have to go up you're at, you're at the lowest there you go make the, the letters even brighter <laughs> i feel like every time i see this sign i need to like dress in a more miami go. appropriate like attire yeah you know you can kind of they're see like the soft and colorful yeah. and a little bit like uh i say it works 80s. i like what it does to the room show yeah it gives yeah. It a very colorful look it does yeah yeah it's uh it's really nice yeah, I need like the sunglasses or something. I don't know what it is, but I do really like the, an HDR the mood. Yeah, that's right. So Wear you your shapeless um, Hermani jackets. <laughs> yes. Um, time to open the boxes. We have oh, some yes, we do have boxes. Exciting Yay, boxes. packages here. Um, here's the first one. My daughter, I like your lights. Yes. Oh, did she say it like that? Yeah. LG hits. <laughs> LG hits. Not made by LG. Yeah. Local company. Uh, okay. Here's the first one. I'm going to use the same box for both because I already used up one of the boxes. <laughs> you should mention the local company that made them. Uh, Do you recall their name? Uh, one second. They did a wonderful job. They but you did. Should, you should give them a shout out because... Well, they, didn't, um, they didn't give it to me for free. No, but they <laughs> did a very good job with it. And uh, Yes. Night night Glow. Yep. Um, yep. Very reasonable price. Yep. And great job, and yep. they delivered it right to my door. Yeah. Like they did. Yeah. It was Showed really up one great. day, and they were there, and it's like, oh, here you go. Here's a huge box with your with your lights. So yep. nice I was luck. only missing Ruby Q from the list of 2600. Excellent. Yeah. So that's a good good choice. All right, boxes. Boxes. What is this? This cat is very excited. Are you excited? Yeah, look at him. Yeah. What is this? What is that? It is a <gasps> controller. More controllers. Uh, I know. I have to sort out what I'm going to do with my controllers. Can you <laughs> guess too what, many con controllers. what controller this is for? <gasps> so many buttons. This is wow. the Atari Jaguar DX Plus Edition VVG Joystick Controller Mark II. What a title. Oh, yeah. my God. Goodness. Serial number prototype. This is a Jaguar controller. Not only is it a Jaguar controller, it's a custom one made wow. for me that includes a spinner. Oh, so cool. So it has a built-in spinner. I don't need a separate controller. It is an arcade style joystick. It's got the three buttons and a button to go back and forth between the spinner nice. and the joystick. Nice. And it's got all the buttons there for the keypad as well. Mm. Uh, I'm going to show it on the uh, cat cam. The cat cam. So you guys can see it. So this is from Double Down. I think he's in the chat. So there is the controller. 
Um, I've been want this. This completes my set of Atari controllers. <laughs> I have an arcade stick for every single controller now, every single uh, console now, because I really, really like the way <laughs> um, Atari um, arcade controllers feel and work for me. Yeah. Um, I'm just so used to them, um, like playing in the arcade and then playing on my Commodore 64. I had a, a joystick the whole way. Yeah. So I'm just, I grew up with it. So yeah, it's a very, very nice looking piece of kit. Yeah. Um, yeah, it says Atari at the top. Yeah. It's very clean, uh, matches kind of the look of the Jaguar. That's a, uh, yeah, with the red and the black. Yeah, yeah very nice. Very nice. Yeah. Yeah, it, uh, you did it, Double Down did an absolutely amazing job on it. Yeah. Wow. Haha, ha. never say this completes my collection. No. <laughs> Co completes my collection of uh, arcade controllers mm -hmm. for Atari systems. So, um, and even I have one for Intellivision and Coleco as well. Um, yeah, so I've got a lot wow. of them now. Lies. Only three buttons. Yeah. Um, <laughs> the only, I don't like fighting games, yeah. so I didn't opt for the six buttons plus two for the shoulder buttons. Mm. And the only game um, that I've played so far is Gravitic Mines, and I actually like the controller, handheld controller for, for that, that game. For that one? Well, because of the... Because of the shoulder yes, buttons. Yes, I can see that. Having the shoulder buttons on here and having to press multiple buttons at once with one hand rather than two hands i can see that i yeah. just i thought it was a bit awkward he does make one that does have the six buttons plus the two um so let's just take a look at gamma that dev right asks, now. so gamma dev are you talking about the sign or the uh, controller how many cats does it measure <laughs> uh the sign oh, is several cats yeah several the controller is about one so <laughs> so he posted this on june 29th i was waiting to reveal the this until we came back uh, to regular shows. I got it like a week or so ago. Oh, okay. Uh, the six button has unique functions on Gravitic Minds. Yes, it does. Um, rotating, uh, straightening out, mm. firing, um, and the shoulder buttons rotate you left and right. Yeah. Uh, playing that with my Repro Pro controller. Don't worry. Oh, they do. They. I don't know about all six, but the shoulder buttons are very important. Yeah, they really And those are only the on the control. Pro controller. So, yeah. Yeah. And energy transfers. There we go. We've got the uh, authority there right in go. the chat. Yeah. <laughs> um, so he posted my controller <laughs> on June 29th, a uh, photo of it right here. Uh, and there you can see it uh, right next to the Jaguar for comparison size. Mm. And uh, you can find out all the stats on it right here, what he used for the joystick and the buttons. Um, I've I've played with it a little bit, and it's just really really it looks nice. Really solid. I really like the yeah, um, very the professional the pad buttons too. Are yeah. nice and solid plastic. Yep, they've got and, a nice bounce to them. And they're very subtly labeled. You can't. Oh yeah. They are labeled. Oh, they I, are I just labeled. noticed that. Yeah yeah. Um, so they're not. They don't stand out. One cat can totally stretch out. A big. Mm, mm. It's like four and a half feet long. That's a big cat. That would be a big cat. What's what are those big cats? Like uh, a tiger no, or a jaguar? The big domestic cats that Lynx? you had once. Oh, uh, Maine Coon. Maine Coon could probably stretch out. No, no. No hot glue here, all mechanically fastened. Nice. Yeah, this is solid. It is solid. It's real, and it's a nice weight. Not yeah. too heavy, but not like you're going to throw it But you want it, it heavy lap. enough that it stays in one spot. Oh, oh, let's see. There you go. I'll yeah. allow that. <laughs> Carl, you got flagged for saying that, for saying the cat name. Um, and I said, absolutely stunning, incredible work. Once again, double down. Yeah. Not saying that it was coming to me, because I wanted it to be a surprise. Um, so we'll be using this on the next Jaguar stream. Um, mm -hmm. Looking, very looking forward to it. Of course, we finished all the, we already finished all the uh, spinner control games, but uh, the well, spinner we'll works. We'll go back and play it. Yeah. Test it out. Spinner works really Absolutely. well. Absolutely. I, I really love this controller. Thank you for making uh, this custom controller so for me. Cool. Uh, double down. Yep. Because um, we went back and forth what I wanted on it, <laughs> yeah. positioning and everything, and I wow. think it works out really well. Yeah. Um, because when you're using the joystick, um, oh, I'll switch back. When you're using the joystick, your hand doesn't hit the spinner. And when you're using the spinner, your hand doesn't hit the joystick. So everything is well spaced. Okay. So oh my one, goodness. I'm gonna 
pretend to put it in the box. Close it up. <laughs> okay, that's good enough. <laughs> okay, the next thing. Uh, uh, cost a fortune to mail to Oz. Well, anything yeah. in or out of Oz, uh, the land of Oz is very expensive. <laughs> Soon, don't worry, kittens. Soon, soon, little kittens. We <laughs> yes. have to get through some things first. Yes. Uh, okay. The next one is something I didn't think I'd ever buy, but circumstances dictate that I do buy it. Yeah. And here it is. Oh. It is. What is that? A new Atari system. <laughs> what? <laughs> Atari VCS, I thought that came out in 1977. Now this is the Atari VCS 800, you know, an amalgamation of two different systems. Yeah. Because it kind of is. It's a computer like the 800. <laughs> wow, you sinner. <laughs> That's Canadian. I know. <laughs> I know. Circumstances. The circum the Atari box, yeah. The yeah. circumstances <laughs> are they are now homebrew on the Atari VCS 800 that don't exist anywhere else. Yeah. Like literal Atari 2600 homebrew that you can run on Atari 2600 that are not out on any platform yeah. except digitally. Yeah. So what can I do? I can't yeah. can't not play all the homebrew. Yeah. Um, I'm sure it was really, really tough to wrench well, that rubber arm to buy something new I though. I didn't. Well, I didn't see a need for a while. I, yeah. I was like, okay, there's some cool. Oh, no, that's fair. There's some cool looking games, yeah. like the modern games, yeah, like that run natively on this. Um, but there's a number of homebrew that are yeah. on it now. Yeah. And to and we're going to do a stream on this on Friday. Oh, try it out for the first time. Yes. For me. Uh, well, you won't be there, unfortunately. <laughs> oh. Yeah. Wow. Well. Darcy will be here. All right. Um, and we will have a special guest, Dion Olsthorn, Dionoid, because his games are on this. Nice. Amoeba Jump and Tower of Rebel. So he's going to chat about that a little. So we're going to okay. have him live on the show talking about his experience of getting his homebrew yeah. on the Atari VCS 800. Um, I will be connecting it up ahead of time for sure. Um, to make sure it's up to speed and working and connected and all that and I'll get the games on it and all that uh, That is just crazy. Not a large market. No, there's only a list about eight games um, There's two games that are only on this right now. Mr. Run and Jump and the other one which name escapes me right now. So uh, Yeah, we'll be taking a look at all that and talking about you know, the future of uh, Atari 2600, 7800 Homebrew. Uh, Bob, Bob D. Crescenzo's game is also on this. Uh, uh, fail safe. Okay, cool. Uh, 7800, so they are yeah. emulated. Going commercial. This is where the community <laughs> sells out. Yeah. Well, we'll see what the future of Homebrew brings. Is this a good thing? Is this a bad thing for the community? Is it an extra revenue source? Is it exposure? to yeah. more people bringing them in to the community um we'll see we'll yeah. see um so we'll be I, I don't need to unbox this because there's a billion this has been out for a long time and there's a billion videos about unboxing it we're just we're concentrating on what home the homebrew aspect mm -hmm. of it because this is a show about new games for the 2600 700 etc etc mm -hmm. um so we'll be sticking to the homebrew on this yep um but it's... Um, I'm kind of excited to check it out, though. It's interesting. Yeah, yeah. yeah. All so these we'll things are fun. I'm going to check that out. Is that going to live upstairs, or are you going to keep it down here? Uh, <clears throat> well, it needs to... Or is it just a fad? Yeah. Yeah, it um, could just be a fad. I mean, I will be hooking it up down here. Yeah. Um, I don't know where it's going to live. That's what I mean, yeah. As long as I can unhook it from upstairs and bring it down easily, <laughs> then it can live upstairs. Yeah. Because yeah. it's got some cool-looking new games on it, well, actually. Well, yeah, yeah. I was... Um, uh, you know flashy reimagined old school games yeah. yeah i like kind of some of that stuff mm -hmm. you know where it's it's actually it's that's my type of game, game. that takes a lot of inspiration from older <clears throat> games and maybe yeah those are my type of games format. i have a yeah, whole rack of retro new games yeah. that are all very pixely and not 3d yeah um are you going to cover the exclusives on friday yes i am it does have the answer map as well mm -hmm. and it's got all the um video streaming apps as well. It's got, you know, YouTube and Netflix and Amazon, I think. I'm not mm -hmm. sure. Definitely give a Qatari credit for getting a console released. I have two collector Amicos. I've been oh waiting my. for years. 
I don't think they're coming. Yeah. <laughs> you may want to give up. Alien Abduction. Yes, yes. the person who made Hero by the... Mm. Um, can't remember his name, but we'll be <laughs> we'll be playing that. We'll be talking about that. We'll be playing the Mister Mister Runnage Up. I think it's out in digital. It's just the cartridge that's coming out. John Van Risen. Yes, the cartridge is coming out at the end of the month mm. for Mister Run and Jump. Um, so we'll be playing the digital version of Mister Run and Jump, and also the digital version of Alien Abduction. Nice. There's been no cartridge talked about for that game, but I yeah. don't know why they wouldn't if they're making a cartridge for Mister Run and Jump. Mm -hmm. Um, so that is all the news. Um, so let's get ITC is a fountain of mostly useless knowledge. Sometimes well, we need We that thank knowledge. you for joining the stream because yes. we need that useless knowledge. Yes. So. Much useless knowledge is dispensed yes. and received yes. on this show. Yes. Especially in the chat. Yeah. <laughs> so, uh, we're going to get into the games right now. Yep. Uh, we're going to be playing Intruders and it is exclusive world premiere, mm. um, by Leandro Camera, HSW3ET. Nice. Let's queue up the intro. Hey, El Camera! Hopefully that didn't double up. It might have. Mm -hmm. um, so we've got a trailer to play of his that'll give you a little... Uh, yeah, it's just a fun trailer to check out uh, before we play the game. And here... I hope it's not too loud. I'm just going to turn down the desktop audio first. There we go. go there's nice. a trailer for intruders oh not done yet
It's like one of those trailers. When you think it's over. Not, not over yet. Here's some more. Nice. Very cool. <laughs> yes, a lot going on on the screen. Um, so let's load it up. So that gives you a little bit of a preview of what it looks like. It's trip time. <laughs> oh, it's trip time. Oh, Good before timing. we get started, Good thank time. you, Rendered Ghosts. You could tell the cats. The cats have been waiting. Well, not Very so patiently, not. but uh, they've been waiting. Not so patiently. Not so patiently. You want the bells? <laughs> oh, lost the screw. Get them in. Gotta find that other screw. Are you ready? Oh, you gotta get... No, close the door. Do we need the door closed? Yeah, we do. Let's switch over to the cat cam. Cat Reset cam. the scores. Kill those door, please. No, cat. Come here. No. Come here. Sorry. Come hey. here. Why do you go out the door when we close it's it? so funny. You're a silly cat. Okay. All right. Are Trick you meows time. ready? Are you meows ready to rumble? Yes, you are. Okay. And go! Oh, Atari's off oh, to the Atari? races. And Sprite is a double ding. He's got tied it up. Oh, Sprite's back for more, and he's got it. Two points. Come on, Atari, get back to the bell. Good job. It's very solid. Oh, Sprite oh is pulling ahead now. Oh my gosh, they are now. hungry They're today. Hungry. They are primed for this. Oh, oh both. one each. Sprite's still ahead by one. My bits rolled over at the perfect time. Oh, excellent. Oh, Sprite really pulls out. He's two ahead now. Atari's really got to catch up. Atari. He's looking at the hand and not the bell. Oh, he's missed the bell. <laughs> oh, Sprite has hit the bell. Atari's just staring. He's looking at the floor. He's confused. Oh, no. Oh, Try too again. soft. Too soft. Oh, oh no. Sprite gets it. Come on, Atari. Ring Come the on, bell. Atari. Look, no. No. Oh, he's flipped it over. <laughs> he did ring it. But he did he, ring it. I'll we'll give you give that him one. That. We'll give him that. He's still very far behind. Yep. He rang it upside down, which is a new feat that we've never seen before. Sprite's already up to eight. Oh, Atari's up five. I don't think he's going to be able to catch up. And it's almost game point. It is now game point. Sprite is nine to five. It's going to be over. Atari is he no chance. It. Oh, and that's no. It. Ten to five. Final score. Here you go. Some consolation. Not a good showing. Well, it started off really good. They were smacking it hard. Not a good showing the for Atari. The sign is throwing Atari off, maybe. Yeah, he's, he's blinded distracted. by the sign. Blinded by the light. Yeah, poor Atari. Oh, sorry. Oh, it can open the door now. Ooh. It's quite warm. It is warm here. <sighs> Maybe okay. not as warm as some of you guys down in the U.S. Yeah, I am uh, worried about everybody. Yeah, me too. In the 40 and almost 50 degree weather. Oh my goodness. 100 to 120 oh, guys, Fahrenheit. Stay, stay nice I'm and learning cool. temperatures now because of this. <laughs> um, okay, first game up is Intruders. Mm -hmm. um, so Leandro Camera sent this over. He said, hi, James. Hi, Tanya. Hi, Cats. Hi, ZPH team and show viewers. I hope these days off went well and everybody's doing well. Mm -hmm. We are. Well, we're better now. We were sick. Mm -hmm. uh, here's my new game for the Atari 2600 called Intruders. I hope you like it. And thank you once again for the space given uh, at the show for new productions for all these consoles that we love so much. You are very welcome. Always a pleasure to show off these amazing, amazing games. Thanks also to my friends who supported me with this game. Uh, Hator Marcel, Vivian Pesabes, uh, Leonardo Santiago, and Daniel Medina. Cheers. Enjoy the game, Leandro Camera. Go for it. And I've got instructions here. And just marvel at this screen. Yeah. It is beautiful and menacing. You can see that yeah. they're dropping aliens down from. Getting massive, like, Independence Day vibes oh, from yeah. this. It's really cool. Lot three ships. You can flashing. tell the distance because they're like. There's the main ship in the middle, mm. and ships in the distance, and they're all dropping down invaders and uh, or War of the Worlds kind of Very, vibes. Yes, yes. Um, and there's a big plot hole in the middle and brick wall. The graphics on this are really, really good. War of the Worlds walkers, yeah. Yes. Victor M says, uh, congratulations to Leandro Camera, another beautiful and amazing game. Yeah. Yes. So, instructions, contamination alert. 
With the intention of conquering new worlds, aliens arrive on planet Earth and spread a mutated virus that transforms humans into beings of their race. Ooh. A lone policeman uh, <laughs> takes charge of the mission and tries to find out where the invaders are multiplying in order to defeat them. Six cities have already been taken up by the intruders. There's six at the bottom there. Mm -hmm. Each of them has four neighborhoods that the character will need to go through uh, in up to seven minutes, collecting dynamite and a detonator to destroy the place where the enemies are hiding. Even infected with the alien virus and his life at risk, the agent decides to wage a direct war with the beings from space. Now he doesn't know who the humans are, who the intruders are, and what he himself is becoming. So, you can turn on and off the screensaver music. This is the screensaver. Okay. With the black and white switch. It was working. Was it? Maybe mine's working. Um, reset starts the game. Hold for one second. So you need to jump over oh, those. Oh, jeez. Okay. Now, you can shoot straight ahead. How? Oh, uh, okay, got it. Now you can got shoot it. up for a, um, and then you can shoot down, which is also, now you want to get that. Oh. oh. Those are the, uh, dynamite. So there's oh. two kinds of shooting into the air. Up, which is a very, um, shallow angle, and down, which is a very narrow angle. Um, goals. One, in the city. You're in the city now. Uh, collect six pairs of dynamite and one detonator. Jump to collect. And then reach city hall. Time limit, seven minutes per city or it's game over. So if you keep shooting the dynamite, it is going to be game over. Oh, I see. Yeah. Little cracks in the sidewalk as well. Falling into holes and contacting aliens loses dynamite. You have to jump. Jump. There you go. So, you've got two dynamite now. Um, so if you uh, contact any aliens, you lose dynamite. Uh, if you fall into the hole, you lose dynamite. Um, so you need to collect... Um, six pairs of dynamite. So you have one. A policeman can pass by walking oh, over the cracks. My like, dynamite turned into a monster! Oh, was it hiding as a monster? I guess so. Um, uh, you can walk over cracks, but you can't walk over holes. There you go. You have to jump over the holes. Yeah. Um, energy bar. Policemen's lives. If you run out of energy, the game is over. So that yellow bar is your life. Energy. Energy recharge. Hit the spaceship or rescue humans. So if you want more energy, I mean, you're still pretty good. Um, you can hit that spaceship for more energy. Oh. Oh. Uh, bonus, hit the spaceship 50 times. What is this times. guy? Oh, he oh. was hiding as an alien. He wasn't a real human. You do want to rescue those dudes. So, what, uh, this thing at the bottom... It's not menacing right now. He's oh, fine. Oh, okay. But, so, I, but yeah. in the video, you could see him shooting. Yeah. So, I guess on a higher level. Oh, oh I see. I have to do it for my next What is I guess I was playing with it. What is it? Thank you. Thank you, Leandro. I guess it was too it was on too hard. Um, was it? I didn't seem to that. Not yet at least. Limited policemen to the left of the screen not being able to rescue humans. Oh, okay. Oh. I think oh. we have to restart. Let's restart. What 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 did I do? Because I oh, had the you wrong can settings. rescue you can't rescue humans. Yeah, that it was on the harder setting. Oh. We're gonna start on the easier setting. I had it on um, you're not able to rescue humans if you're on the left hand side of the screen. And also, it was on a slow shot. Now you have a faster shot. Okay, so that's the instructions for the cities. Collect the dynamite. Um, don't hit anything. Don't step in the cracks. Don't let that guy hit you, or else you lose the dynamite. You have seven minutes to collect six pairs of dynamite and the detonator. And there's a lot going, so you can't rescue this guy. You so just I jump. jump? Up. There you go. Lot going on. He's he's used um, the verticality of the of the system really really well, with something going on on every single level. There's like the head crabs on the bottom. <laughs> and head crabs. Then there's the crack. Um, then there's like 
that running guy, and then there's also a guy to rescue, and then there's uh, two enemies up above. Oh. Ah. Yep, I switched it over, uh, Leandro. To BB. So it should be better. So I will... Oh, switch positions, black and white, changes only in opening screens, hitting in the yeah. Advisable to play initially on BB. Yes. And color. So we do have that in color and BB now. Dynamite comes in packs of twos. Yes. So you can't have one dynamite at a time. You always gain two and lose two. Rescue. Oh, ah. it was... Oh. Oh. You got to rescue them. I think you have to get them right ahead. away. Because I've noticed if they get too close to you, then they, they turn yeah. into aliens. Maybe my switch didn't work. I don't know. It's fine. Because you are able to rescue them. In the other way, you are not able to rescue them at all. Always hit that guy coming towards you as soon as possible. Because he will take away your dynamite. The guys up above aren't shooting right now, so there's no, no panic for them. Oh, good idea, train! Now read out uh, the city hall information when we get to it. Uh, okay, goal one. Uh, you need to collect six pairs of dynamite and one detonator that in possession of the invaders to collect objects, jump with the character. The policeman's health is represented by the enemy uh, energy bar, which is full right now. So you've got um, three pairs, so you need three more. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh boy. You may run out of time. No, you're, you restarted. Um, oh, rescuing the humans gives you way more energy. Oh! Too late. Come on! And you lost. I ran into him multiple times. Um, points. Close enough, obviously. Get 25 points for the alien spaceship. 75 oh. points for the giant alien. 50 points for the mutant alien. 300 points for human survivors. You get tons of points for that. 250 points for dynamite. 1,000 points for collecting the detonator. Uh, the alien parasite does not score. So that, I'm guessing that's the uh, kind of... Uh, no, I did it again. Meow. I think you're running out of time. Keep, I keep uh, seeing it just out of the corner of my eye and shooting it. Now only shoot straight. I would just hold up the whole time. Or down. Down and shoot. Down and shoot. Oh, the down. Yeah, that's easier. Um, obstacles. Hole drops dynamite and loses one energy charge, so as we also lose energy when you hit the hole. But the worst is losing the dynamite. Alien contact steals dynamite and lose one energy charge. Ground virus uh, lose two energy charges, but they're not a threat at the moment. Probably on higher levels. They're just like scampering around. Um, air virus enemy fire lose three energy charges. Destroy dynamite and detonator lose a one energy charge. Warning, policeman passes freely through the cracks in the asphalt. Yeah. Um, police officer, character movement joystick. Use a left joystick to move the policeman around the scenarios. Right, policeman advances. Left, policeman retreats. Jump. Almost there. You go one, two, three, four, two more. Oh, because I... Don't shoot couple. ahead. You're shooting ahead. Oh, the city disappeared for a second. Yeah. Oh. You don't need to jump to shoot upwards. You can use a jump joystick yeah. down. Yeah. Yeah. I think it's, it's easier. better. It's yeah. actually easier. And you get more hits on that uh, spaceship yeah. too, because uh, it quickly bypasses past your shallow angle, and you don't jump. So it's big benefits for that. Nostalgia says, "I like the change in the cityscape as you go through the changes, uh, the levels." Yes. Oh, I think you need just one more now. No. No, no one, to. two, three, four, five. One more. And the deck. Don't shoot ahead! I'm not oh. trying to. I was pushing down. Peter says no. No, just on an angle. <laughs> Which is not the best way to do it. Up, policeman jumps, also collects objects. Top right diagonal, policeman jumps forward. Upper left diagonal, policeman jumps back. Warning, you can move 
the character in the air while jumping, which is which is nice. It's good. It's a standard for video games now. <gasps> no. Oh, you I, lost one. I meant to. I meant to hit up. Oh. And it hit forward, and then it hit one again. Oh no. Uh, I'm running out of time. Is the time on the bottom? No, that's your health. So time is unknown. No bar for the time. Oh, I think you're running out of time. The city's flashing. There it is. Don't shoot it. Now you just need the detonator. I think it's like one minute warning? I'm not sure. Doesn't say. Markiana says, uh, getting the I run vibes. Yeah, because it is an endless runner. You can pull back to stop the movement, but you don't want to do that because you want to get to the, the detonator and the... And uh, the explosives. Oh, did I get to it? Nope, ran out of time. Did I? So close. Oh. Yep. Now I'm a now I'm a monster. Okay, All I'll right. give you this, and you can read out the city if I get to it. The city? City information, city instructions, or the town hall instructions. Okay. Goal two, you mean? Uh, yes. I'm sure you will. Kept accidentally shooting forward. You can hold it down. So you can just stand in one place. Fire forward. Fire up. Oh, oh you bastard. No, nope, you gotta get that right away. Oh, he didn't get me. No, because you're down to two. I only got one. They come in pairs. No, but, oh. Did you I jump think, over? Yeah, I think you can jump over him. I saw that in the uh, <coughs> video. Okay, that where, makes sense. Where he jumped over, and I'm like, what? <laughs> no! See how easy it is? It's super easy. You see it uh, out of the corner of your eye. At least I didn't lose one. No, you don't lose one. Yeah. You, just you just don't game Set one. yourself back. <laughs> wonder how many extras you can shoot accidentally. Oh, uh, and actually win the game? Yeah. Yeah, don't or shoot Or at least it. on level one. I notice the cracks in the road sometimes change size when they're on the screen. Usually when picking yep. up dynamite, is this intentional? Oh. Also, if you shoot the dynamite, the cracks... They it's, they seem to respond to action, close. like um, when you get something, oh, they'll yes. open and close, it or when just, you shoot something, it opens or, and it closes sometimes. It just opened when I got that guy. I like it. It's responding to the environment. But it also just randomly opens and closes. Oh! Or it just coincides with something you did. Mm -hmm. The city's health works on crackpot's logic. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Six. Nice. Yeah, it's yeah, the level one, one where they don't shoot. No, the guy at the bottom was really freaking me out in the beginning. I'm like, what am I supposed to do? Nothing. Norm. He has no power. Yeah, but he's creepy. He's super creepy. He's a head crab. Someone said uh, Stranger Things vibes. Oh, yes. Stranger Things. I guess we're, I'm guessing we're getting another season of that at some point. Can't see. Yeah. It certainly didn't end with the last one. Nope, still, uh, still popular. Mm -hmm. They're gonna make more. Probably like, oh, we need to introduce some younger kids because uh, these Our ones kids are, are getting too old and, now. Yeah. And uh, uh, we need kids in this. Kids in the 80s. Yeah. Kids in the 80s. Yeah. It's perpetually the 80s. Yeah. Oh, the kids are 16 now. Uh, what do we do? Nope. Oh, nope. I missed it, but yeah. I jumped over him, thankfully. Uh -oh. I mean, I... oh, I think I hit the hit the guy enough times. Oh, you got energy back. Ah, uh, okay. yeah. No way with the strikes as RC-70. Well, yeah. Well, not, not for a while. Not right now. And the last strike oh. uh, lasted a very long time. RC-70 says, I didn't see the last two episodes. Wife and I just haven't cared to finish it. <laughs> It, I find that with shows sometimes you kind of yeah, lose interest along the go, way. I mean, 
like starts that off would... strong and then it just kind yeah. of gets Or I'm interested, bloats. but then once I haven't watched it in a while, you kind of lose interest or can't quite figure out, you know, what, how to get back into it. Yeah. yeah. Too much. It's too much. Thank you for following somebody. Playing Can't See. Can you read out their name, please? It, flash on it didn't screen. flash up on here. It doesn't. Uh, the activity fee? Yep, yeah, top of the activity fee. MWG Maker followed us. MW no, that was that was a subscribe. Oh. Was it? Well, then it should be in the feed. In the it's chat. Not at the top. No, they have to they have to put it in the chat, don't they? I don't oh, know what yeah, happened. They do. I don't no, know. it's a follow. It says right there, follow. Yeah. Yeah, but it, it said subscribe. subscriber. No, it says follow. No, but it said subscriber. The the the, the sound, didn't it? No, nope. thank you for following. Mm, that's not what it sounded like. Lies. Not what it sounded like to me. It was quiet though. Yeah, because it just blasts if I don't turn it down. There's a detonator. Okay, read out the city. I don't know what I'm doing. Okay, free the city from the invaders. Go to the left corner of the screen and collect the dynamite joystick down. Take six pairs of dynamites one by one to the city hall and drop them at the door of the building. Joystick down. Now okay. use the detonator to destroy the alien's hide hideout. To restore the policeman's energy, shoot the alien pro. Gets three charges. That flies over the location. If four parasitic aliens enter the building, Earth will be irreparably irre contaminated and the <sighs> game shooting. will be over. Oh, they're shooting now. Oh my god. Oh, everything's shooting. Oh my god. Oh my goodness, so much going on. Oh How do I goodness. do this? Down to pick it up. Oh, that's the. How do I detonate it? Help oh, me. you don't know it. Did you put six in there? Yeah, six it's pairs done. of dynamites? Then you down okay. for the detonator. Yeah. Oh. Good job. Hooray! Okay, now I think it's gonna get much harder. Because they're gonna be starting to shoot at me. Hey, I, I destroyed City Hall! For good reason. <laughs> Very good reason. The aliens were in there. So what happens? Right. Do I just wait this? Joystick right? Oh. That was an intense end to the stage. Yes, yeah. it was. <laughs> Andrew. It's just like in 1812, and right. the War of 1812, when the Canadians burned down the White House. British. Le the, the British. Well, they were Canadians. Oh, right. There we go. Okay. Got it. <laughs> oh, now they're shooting. Oh, and I got that. <laughs> now I do need to get health. Your little piece of Canadian trivia. Yeah. And yep. now, Stay Puff Marshmallow Man. <laughs> <laughs> Ow. Oh, it's a lot harder now. Didn't we burn the White House down twice? How do I kill I that guy? You don't. You stay really? away. I don't know. Can you shoot down? Oh, nope. he just goes away. Okay. No, you can't shoot down. You just have to avoid his shots, I guess. He just pauses from time to time and shoots yeah. a lot. Oof. The city looks different. Yeah, it does. It looks great. The backgrounds look fantastic. Yeah, really great use really of fantastic. play field. Uh, I love the, the little horizon the little you know it looks like it's uh oh yeah nice dusk. blue little light blue right on the horizon yeah there. just starting really nice. to go to be uh nighttime in this case you can fight sleep <laughs> oh i guess that's just like you can't go here now until the head crap goes away head yeah crap. <laughs> <laughs> it reminds me of what is it? Thing the hand. Oh yeah, that too. Well, now it's getting uh, they, a little they bit. They already more. said Strange Things will end at season five. Five. What's coming up? Four. Five, I think. I think there've been four seasons. That makes sense. The yeah. Duffer Brothers already are set to adapt Stephen King's The Talisman, which Stranger Things already that. resembled in tone. Oh. Yeah, okay. I can kind of see that. God damn it! Lost. A Oh, very John Carpenter for sure. <laughs> this? This game? I see. Yeah. Which one? Which John Carpenter movie? 
I don't think he did any alien invaders. Other than the thing. Children of the Corn, but that's like... Is that aliens? And it was aliens, yes. Was it? Yeah. It was aliens. Um... Trying to think through all the John Carpenter films, because we watched all of them. I own all of them, yes, I'm ashamed to say. Yes, we had a John Carpenter film festival. Oh, I guess I guess uh, they live, but oh, yeah. um, these don't resemble the aliens in they live. No, they, no, definitely just, the thing. They're just ugly humanoids. Yeah, Gamma Death says they live also aliens, yeah. Yes, that's true. This is a lot more intense, <laughs> now that they're shooting. Still not too bad at, like, health is not a, really a concern, still. Head crab, stop it! Ah! ah! No, he took one of mine! Yeah, you gotta get those oh, right away. Oh, you can't away. shoot while you're flashing, either. Uh, I'm not gonna make what it this What is this time. guy? Oh, he's like... Oh, Keith, you can jump over that, I bet. Oh, the... He's black, he's got a black shot. Did he? Yeah. Oh, don't shoot. Shoot forward. Oh, I love the aliens. It looks fantastic. The graphics are astounding. They're that so that great. alien in the sky is oh, frightening yeah. looking. Damn oh, you it! Gotta shoot him. Gotta shoot oh, him. Oh no! Cut your toe! You cut I'm your dead. toe! It's okay, it's a hard level. I'm not gonna make this level. Not enough time. Just lost too many. Wow. Lost too many dynamites. Just too much going on. It's not prepared. No! Don't shoot there! Really want to rescue that guy in the wall early. Oh, you have to get you have to run across the screen and get him. Because otherwise you are getting hit. Kind of like um, the prawns from. Uh, yes, uh, District Nine. District Nine. Yeah, that's more. As he more... evolves into the into the prawn. This this game rem reminds me more of a District bit of that. Nine. Yeah, a little bit of that. Than, than much anything else. If it weren't for the spaceship, this could also work as an HP Lovecraft. Oh. Or in the Mouth of Madness, if we're still on John Carpenter. Yep. Ooh, nice. Good. Oh no, I got my health back. Doesn't give me time. I don't think. Gives you a lot of points, though. Yeah. You have enough cat food for Damn D9 it. prawns. <laughs> yeah, we have cat food. But we have a lot of cat food. They'd like us. We can feed them. Except humans kind of won in District 9. They were able to contain the aliens. It's kind of a, a cool, unique story where it's like, oh, what happens after the alien invasion? They never show that. But yeah. in District 9, they did. So I thought that was like... That's why it did it's so well, because it's so unique. It's it's interesting. Oh, I need two more. I don't think I'm going to make it. I don't know. If I don't shoot anymore, I get hit. I'm getting a little bit better at not being hit. Oh, oh nice. too late. Got him, though. Got him. It's okay. I don't care about the rescue. <laughs> I just care about not... Not dying. Not dying. It's it's it's, it's for the, the good good of all. There's one. Don't shoot it. Whatever you do. Need one more. I think the detonator comes pretty quick after um after you get the after you get the last um yeah. dynamite. It's very nice at this level. It was, level one is is a good starter. Because this is water. There's lots to jump over. You have to keep an eye on the guy on the bottom, too. Uh, yeah. yeah. I combine the jumping whenever I can. Ugh. Always jump over those cracks. Okay, I might make it. Maybe. Oh, boy. Can you lose it after it starts flashing? I bet you can. We don't want to test that. Detonator. Detonator. Oh my gosh. Get him. Get him. Get him. Got him as soon as I could. Come on, detonator. Need it. Oh, out of 
time. No! <laughs> so close! Oh. <laughs> so close. But we saw both levels yes. of the game. We don't want to give it all away. No, no, no. 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 Um, so, the, so the options yeah. to make it harder is you can switch the left switch to uh, A, which yeah. limits the policeman to the left-hand side of the screen, so oh. you don't get to go forward as much. Oh my goodness. And you're not able to rescue humans at all. Mm. So you have to deal with them changing into the, mm. um, the enemy. Um, and also, uh, the right switch going to A is a slow shot. So it's slower bullets than that. Oh, wow. Okay. Which is really hard. So and This title screen is is gorgeous. Oh, it's It's amazing. the preamble to the invasion. It yeah. shows you what happened. Yeah. Um, absolutely beautiful, mm -hmm. Leandro. I think this is your best game yet. Um, there's a lot going on mm -hmm. with it, and it's huge action. Does that alien have a cane? No, he's like just walking dragging, the cane? he's walking on his... Oh, four... Yeah, all his legs. Four legs, yeah. Really, really good. Um, yeah. So, this is uh, for sale right now. Pre nice. pre Pre-orders, I believe. Um, so, if you wanted to um, get that, you can. I think I have a link up. Let me just look. Want to play, tri uh, try playing? Oh, Tanya did. Um, we will play it for a second. No. So if you wanted to order it, uh, you can email uh, Leandro. Um, if Leandro wants to put his email in the chat, mm -hmm. I don't have it handy right now. Um, but you can also go to his Facebook, it was Zarkstars, mm -hmm. or go to zarkstars.com mm -hmm. um, forward slash intruders. Hey, Arena Foot. Um, yeah, let me just play the hard version briefly, just to show the slow shot. Not couch compliant. <laughs> oh, yeah. A. A. Okay, so the bullet is really slow. Well, upward bullet's not slow. The forward bullet is slow. Ooh. Didn't have any anyway. And we'll wait till there's like a, a guy on the wall to rescue. And then we'll see. No! Ugh. You can't shoot after you, you start flashing either, so you're, you're vulnerable if you make a mistake. It's hard because you're limited to there. That's as far as I can go. Oh, really? You can't go any and farther see that than guy? That. You can't get him unless you use the alternate shot now because you're limited to... Um, What's the alternate shot? Um, pressing up and shooting. You can see down is shallow. Oh. Pressing up is less shallow. You can only get him if you do the less shallow oh. because he can't run as far on the screen. Oh, here comes a guy. I can't get him. I'll try and get him. Nope, it's alien time. <laughs> there you go. So there's there's the advanced stage. So there's lots of room for people who think it's too easy. <laughs> uh, level one is, is very good, like uh, mm -hmm. in terms of an intro. Mm -hmm. Level two, it starts to get challenging. If I played it again, I'd be able to do it, I think. Make it to the... Um... Make it to the next part. Okay, on to the next game. Thank you so much, Leandro. Thank you for letting us uh, premiere the game. It is gorgeous. Yes. Um, so, it is now time for our Meow 2. But meow don't press two. it yet. No, I won't, I won't. Because it's a... Exclusive world premiere. <laughs> this is by uh, Mir Sad Sarah Lika. Uh, and this is a sequel to mm -hmm. the uh, Meow that we played, where I'm huge in the top left of the screen, and there's little kitties yeah. getting things. 
Yep. And I'm controlling the kitty. So Who this doesn't is like uh, little kitties getting things. Yeah. yeah. And he says the video game tentatively titled Meow 2 is planned to be based on the game Meow that I casually developed. Mm. Since the game bears too much resemblance to Kaboom, this new cat themed game aims to revolve around a cat collecting falling food and reaching the cake placed on the top shelf. <gasps> Bad kitty. Cake. Additionally, like in the first version of the game, there will be a feature to freeze or temporarily halt the food so the cat gains a time advantage. Nice. If this concept doesn't succeed, I will change the storyline of the game to something else because I really like this cat. <laughs> it's a cute kitty. All right, are we all ready? Yep, we are ready. Meow too. Meow too. Meow too. <laughs> Aww. There's that kitty. Look at he's he's licking his paw. Licking. He's going click 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 his paw. He's got little white <laughs> white little paws, and he's a gray blue cat. Yeah, there we go. Um. Okay. So there's no real instructions. Okay. Um, other than get to the cake, and you can press the button to pause things. So you have to kind of manage, um, the ladders, as well as the burgers falling. Because if you go up too high, you won't be able to... You'll miss the burger. So you have to... Um, Cake! Go. Cake! And then on subsequent levels, you'll have to build ladders. Oh my goodness. <gasps> and now it's root beer. Ooh, Kitties root beer. don't have root beer. Yes, they do. And you can press ah. the button to pause the falling. Oh, if you, you can? absolutely need to. But you only get one pause per game. One pause. Pause. That's what it needs to one be called. Pause. I mean, it's a long pause. You can use it twice, but once it goes down, you can't uh, use it again. Nope. Yay, cake! So if you're running out of time, you can just go for the cake. Yep. And it clears the screen. Yeah. So I think there's three levels or four four levels per per round, and then the game gets faster. So it gets very complicated when um, you have to get something and then go back down. Uh, you have to kind of align your movements where the cakes are and where you need to go up. Because some one falls to the left hand ah! side. They're getting faster? They feel like they're getting faster. Yeah, they do get faster if you take too long. Oh no! You get faster and faster. Burgers, root beer, and a cake. Cat's usual diet, Metalunar says, yes. Ah, uh, no, no! Oh, you can't fall off the edge. Nope. Oh, no. You have to use the ladders. Cats. Cat. This cat can't jump. Poor kitties who can't so jump. So really, you have to get up to the next level yeah. as quick as possible. Um, because this is the only long level. So you really want to stay on the long... No! Oh, you better hurry. Nope. Oh, my goodness! If you give a cat a cupcake with a fun children's book, I've never heard of that one. Oh boy, you're pressing Oh my button. goodness! You know what? I have trouble getting up and down the ladders a little bit because it's it's a. You pretty can use narrow... diagonals to um, prime yourself for the ladder. Mm. So if you press up and to the left or right, yeah, you'll automatically go up the ladder. But just a warning: after you go up the ladder, you have to reset the up again. You can't just go up, 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 up. Oh, I see. Um, it has to learn, like it resets the up. It's like, oh, you need to press up again. It's just a warning. So he's carried over the incredible graphics. Like the cat, the cat in this one is so cute. With the yellow eyes and the pink nose. No! Press the button. You can pause. Yeah, but does it pauses for a second. No. What? No, hold it. Oh! Here's I didn't know you could yeah. do that. I didn't know that. I yep. thought it was just an Sorry. instant. It's the same pause. as the other game. Well, not. Ah, oh, it takes it takes you, some health. Uh, well, that's it's just the pause meter. That's not your health. You won't die when you run out. You just can't do it anymore. You only get it once per game. So if you use it on the first level, it's all gone, gone forever. <laughs> yeah. On this level, you want to get that one as soon as possible yeah. and get up to the second... The third level. The third level quick, when you can. Really, you want to do it when the cupcakes or the cakes are on the right-hand side, a string of cakes on the right-hand side. Nostalgic says, I really like how this game has evolved from the original Meow. The platformer really adds to it. It really does. 
Perfect time. Go, go up, up, up. There you go. Yay, Yay cake. Press the bu red button yeah. to temporarily freeze the falling object so the cat can reach and eat in time. Yeah. And it does have a pause in between each level, which <gasps> is nice. Apples. And a bullet. <gasps> what? So, Who's shooting at your cat? Oh, That's some, mean. some meanness. Maybe it's a bug. A stingy bug. Oh, I'm having trouble getting up and down. No. That's not where you want to be. There you go. Be very careful. Don't go up to the next level. But then you need to go up to the next level as soon as possible now. Get it. Go up. Oh. The perfect opportunity to get up there. No. Oh, no. my God. Good playing. Don't no. Up. Don't go up. Oh, the bullet was going to be there anyway. So now you're in real trouble. It's falling fast. It's it so is cute. hard. It's yeah, so the colors cute. are colors are really nice. Yeah, very pastel nice. colors. Yeah. yeah, they're all very soft colors. Yes, I like that. I like the burgers. <laughs> and you can just hang out up here, getting points if you want. Just go right up to the top. But I'm concerned about levels. <laughs> mm. I want to see all the levels. Well, you saw the fourth level. Then it just yeah. repeats and gets faster. Oh, you're flying through this one. That's what you need to do. Yeah, you do. Is you do it fast. Although I just seem to struggle with the ladders. <laughs> you want to stay on a full platform until you can, like, yeah. make sure you can Make get it all the way up. Yeah, or you just go right for the cake. Yep. I'm wasting you have to too plan much time. It. And then it resets with oh, faster. faster. Faster burgers. Now, uh, Mirsat says he is past the eighth level to get to the third round. Oh, really? I can't do that. But he I'll try. Just, uh... Damn it! Damn it, damn it, damn it. Yeah, you're just going right for the cake when you can get to the cake. Yep. I'm panicking and I'm like, no, no, get them all. There you go. Good job. Okay, this is the level I can't pass because the bullet interferes. Yeah. Use the pause, though. I use the pause. You gotta use the pause. Okay. It's the furthest I've ever made. But it resets now, so good luck to me on this one. So fast. Oof. Can't pass. Passes on oh, the first yeah, try. Oh yeah, exactly. <laughs> you gotta, you gotta use reverse psychology with games. <laughs> yeah. You say you're doing awesome, you're gonna die immediately. It's so true. You say you can't do it, you do it. Yeah. The game knows. The game can hear you. Just Good made job. it, and now I have no time. This is where I die. Three in a row. <laughs> oh, yeah, you don't get more back, do you? Nope. I can't even make it across the screen barely to get the next one. Oh, I ugh, ran into the bullet. Stupid. Oh, you, he did reset the... Yeah, when you die. Oh, when you die, that's right, okay. Hurry up! Oh, I, I, I don't have the thing. No. Oh. Meow tube. Good job. 12180. <laughs> I don't think I'm going to make it that far. Can I have a sip of that yummy? Yep, yep, yep. Yummy, yummy drink. It is a yummy drink. Sorry. In the way. 
The graphics are so detailed and so good. Like you can see the foam on the root beer on this. It's really, really good at the graphics. Like, if anybody doesn't know, this is the same person who did uh, Caramucho. Caramucho? Caramujo, uh, the snail, which also has just oh, astounding, Caramujo. astounding graphics. Um, Mirset also did Three Point Dash, Final D, Meow, and Stellar Drive. What is the size of this game? Oh, sorry, it's a 32K game. Um, probably because it uses DPC Plus. Um, and I believe all DPC Plus games are 32. Um, because of the hugely detailed graphics. That's probably why. Single line kernel graphics. Oh, where's your rapper? Is near sad. He's got three go. names. Too many names. He's got Kiki PDPH on, on the Atari H forums. In the chat, he's got Ojo Rapper 2600, and his real name's Mirsad. There you go. Three names. Yeah. <laughs> That's why I get confused we all have so a few much. Names. That's ah, true. Press a button. It didn't go down. You it might as well press down. a button because. No, I don't want to lose um, it. No. Well, you die. if you die, you get a reset anyway. Yeah. So it's better to press it and ah. press a button. You just got it. This also reminds me of Popeye. With the hearts falling down. Oh, goodness gracious. Ugh! Just, if it went up the ladders when I wanted it to, oh. this wouldn't be a problem. And last game, The Intr Intruders, is a 16K game. And uh, Leandro Camera also made uh, Midnight Commando, Orbital War, Polar Rescue, Rally Racer, Satellite Fortress, Zark Stars 1 and 2 and 3, and ZPH the game. Yay! So actually, we're playing two games in a row of people who made games for us. Which is so wonderful. Yeah. Said PH the game and Meow 1. Meow 1. We can call it Meow 1 because now there's a Meow 2. <laughs> no! Go for the cake. Oh, oh my goodness, you go down! should have gone for the cake. Down! Oh. That's what happens with ladders and games. Get the cake. Oh, just in time. Oh. Just in time. Just can't hit those ladders. Oh, it's like on uh, Donkey Kong uh, and just like on Popeye, ladders and games. Oh, no. that's what I did last time. No, no, oh, no, no point. No point. Get that dot. Get it. Get the yellow dot. Oh, go, go, go. Yeah. Yeah, just in time. <laughs> so you made it to the second round. Oh, I made it before. Oh, last okay. Time. <laughs> Not the third, but the second round. Yeah. yeah. Phew, third. Oh, my God. Brutal. No! Go! Uh, press the button! No! I don't like using up the button, though. I'd almost rather die. <laughs> rather die than use the button. It's cheating. <laughs> it's part of no. the game. Oh. Press the button! Go to the cake! No, you're wasting! Could have gone right to the cake! Oh, I always forget that! This the one cake has is free! Free cake. The cake is not a lie. It's right there. Oh! oh. oh terrible, terrible strategy. Oh, El Camera says it was Yay. a pleasure to make the game for you and you deserve it. Oh, ZPH, the game is so cute. It's so cute. And puts everybody in it. No, I, I'm not, I'm not going to do it again. No? I did very well. Oh, I see. And there's no way I can pass the third <laughs> round bullet. Okay. No way. I if somebody can do it, go for it. Yeah. But, um, S. Ramirez has written that down. <laughs> and um, I think um, uh, Mirsad is going to release this. Oh, cool. On the forum shortly after. He can nice. um, say it in the chat uh, to confirm that if he wants. Mm. Tanya is a kind of RPG player that has 99 potions, 99 ethers, because she never uses items. That is so... Actually, she's a magic user. I'm like that, though, for Sometimes. sure. Sometimes, yeah. Like, Oh, I might need them for the final boss. I gotta collect them, collect them, and then you. But yeah. you're so powerful by you get. To, by the time you get to the final boss, you don't need them. I've been playing Zelda, and I have like a full inventory, and I hate selling anything, even though you need to sell stuff. Oh, yeah. Landry got his copy of ZPH the game. Awesome. <laughs> That's great. Um, is it the signed copy that we sent? I must have been. Yeah. yeah. That's great. Nice. Sorry, I interrupted you. No, no, no. Okay. Yeah. Um, thank you so much for letting us play Meow 2, mm -hmm. Premier Meow 2, and Intruders. Both uh, really fun games. Awesome. And now we get on to more games. More games. Because why not? 
Next one is Heist 2 by Timothy Marsh. And uh, I had a lot of fun playing Heist 1. <laughs> Here you go. Okay. Actually, we got to show uh, the instructions on the screen. Okay. For this one, because they are graphical instructions. Oh, oh, there's Kiki PDPH. Good so, morning. So, Rapper isn't um, who I thought they were. <laughs> Funny. Okay. Here is the game. Heist for 26... Heist 2 for 2600. Donnie has never been on the right side of the law, but he can't remember a time when he was so far away from the line. <laughs> At least if he goes forward with what he's planning, 20 heists. All heavily fortified banks. The plan comes with a lot of risk, but also a lot of reward. Mm. And he could use the money. No, he needs the money. <laughs> the guy owe, the guys he owes aren't the type that just repossess your car. They take lives. Of course, he shouldn't have... He should have never gotten involved with the cartel, but he wasn't thinking clearly at the time. Is he thinking clearly now? Only time will tell. <laughs> Joystick, one player. Nice. General screen layout. This is this very similar to Heist 1. Gotcha. So that that's the player. You're in gray. Congratulations, Meow Team. Um, Donnie's uh, those, ambitious. Donnie's yeah. ambitious. You know, Donnie. Players in white. Okay. Guards gotcha. in blue. It's a, a laser in red, and the money bag is obviously the money symbol okay. there's your score there's your bullets uh bullet clips <clears throat> timer three bullets each mm -hmm. you have a timer very similar to the first one so you shoot the guards and then get shoot the guards get the money escape okay. out of the room okay when you lose a life the bullet clip bars will be momentarily replaced by dots to show you remaining lives you gotcha. also have lives in addition to this okay. but it's just no no it doesn't screen. show until you die yeah so there you go you can see the two one there. remaining life okay yeah Gameplay. Capture the money while avoiding the guards and laser defenses. Once the money is in your possession, a door will open. Uh, you need to make it out of the bank to clear the level. All of this must be done before time runs out and with limited bullets. Note that the guards don't be shoot, shoot, shoot. Aim carefully. So it's kind of stealth, mm -hmm. but also shooting. Note that the guards will not initially notice you until you're in their general proximity. Once you capture the money, alarm will be alarm is sounded, and all guards become aware of your presence. They'll move with an increased sense of urgency. Yeah. On a set, a session, on a session. I don't know. You will see an extra life icon. Grab the icon to add a life. Okay. Halfway through the levels, the play field will turn blue. The guards will start to move faster and you'll have one less bullet. Uh -oh. The faster pace makes the guards behave a bit differently than previously and strate strategies may need to be adjusted. Mm -hmm. Upon completion of all levels, you will achieve the title of Master Criminal. Yes. The game then ends, meaning the game can be won. Now, we didn't finish the first one. This gets really hard. Um, movement, use joystick up, down, left, right, diagonals. Uh, shooting, press fire button, bullet travels in the direction the player is moving or was last moving if standing still. So you can move, wait for him to get into mm. position, and then shoot him. Uh, pause, color black and white, black and white to pause. Uh, the play field walls will turn light gray, and the player will face left to indicate it's paused and back to color. Okay, scoring, 1,000 for each money bag stolen. You will lose the money if you are caught. What? These are images? Oh, okay. Just goes back to that. Uh, you'll lose the money if you're caught or die before making it through the exit nice. door. Where is Conan? I don't know. <laughs> Where is Conan? Oh, I didn't change the graphics. Oh, no. For the second game. The meow game? Yeah. Show the meow. Here's the meow graphics. Oh, no. Briefly. Meow, too. It's a little sad. sad Blue kitty. Cat. He wants his cake. <laughs> there we go. Oops. There we go. There's Heist. Okay. Let's uh, let's get into heist number two. So I think the or original heist is from 2019. No, nope. no, don't get hit by the red uh... lasers. You do want to shoot all the guys because when you go out, oh my goodness, um, when the alarms sound, then you're <sighs> then you're toast. Gosh. Oh, uh, this game is available right now in the Atari Age forums. Um, if you go to my thread of Zero Page Homebrew, I link every single game to their their threads. Um, but you can also do a search for uh, Heist 2. Oh my 
I now you see why you need to shoot all these guys. Where am I going? Out that Out back the door? Exit. Out the top right. Oh, you got two in one. Interesting. Yeah. Next level. So if you want to download these games, uh, the first two, the first one is on pre-order. Second one will be released into the forums um, soonish. This one's already posted in the forums, the Atari Age forums. Um, and the fourth one is also in the forums as well. Oh no. You can just go around them. You're faster. Ah. You've, been, you've been running. I can uh, I can post the link to this one if uh, oh my goodness. you want to find it right now. Let me copy and paste it. Oh my goodness, it was below. Oh my goodness. That's for Heist 2. Uh, this one is for Meow 2. There you go. And here is Intruder. So you can read about all three of them. Sorry, I started over. There are a couple line... Oh, gotta stop doing that. A couple line count issues with this game. If you notice, like, the jump once in a while, it's not too bad. Um, but my okay. retro tank smooths those out. Um, on other systems, you may see your screen either blank out or really kind of flip out. But uh, the Retro Tank 5X has. Uh, that's why you got to shoot that other guy first. Yeah. Yeah. I did. I did it last time without without a problem. Yeah, it's if because they come back. It's all about the time. No, no, not all. Of yeah, them. they do. One extra one gets added. This feels reminiscent of the original Castle Wolfenstein with its stealth elements and screen layout. It does. It really does. I wonder if somebody could recreate Castle Wolfenstein for the 2600. It seems I bet you could. Because if I remember correctly, Wolfen Castle Wolfenstein had actually even a more zoomed in screen than this. I have issues with the Berserk cart from Atari Age. The game goes black after five screens. Oh, no. Oh, no. Talk to Al. Um, because that definitely shouldn't be happening. Um, so. Oh, he comes from the bottom. <laughs> he uh, didn't. I swear that didn't happen last time. Oh, boy. Oh, well, I got my extra life. I mean, if you have another Atari system to plug it into, you definitely should try that first before... Um, Right down the middle. Contacting him. But if you don't have another Atari system, it's good. To, he's, the best thing to do is just uh, message him. I guess you have to count what level you're on. Does it say what level? No. Because there's 20 total. Ah! Corner! Same issue with the Retron 77. Oh, okay, then it might be your cart then. Oh, no line count issues, just how DPC Plus works with multi-sprites. Okay. What level did you get to? Oh, not that far. Hey, TX Mark. Third or fourth, something like Welcome that. Welcome to the chat. We've got the developer uh, in the chat. Yay. I like it, though. It's fast-paced. Oh, yeah. Get all panicky. <laughs> or I do. <laughs> I still have that lingering cough. Sorry. Yeah. Takes uh, a while. I had mine for suck. two weeks, two and a half weeks. At least you don't get killed on the, the walls. Uh, it's so hard when the walls kill you. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I guess it's easier to kill them because only one comes back. Oh, yeah, just kill them. Yeah, I, I've been avoiding it because I thought, oh, no, I'm going to run out of bullets. But uh, on if only some levels, one you comes might. back, then... He goes through the lasers. Yeah, they have... Uh... Laser. Mm -hmm. What do you think of the writer strike? I think it's fully justified. <laughs> um, oh, and the SAG strike as well. Um, people should be uh, paid, paid a working, uh, a living wage. I mean, it's more like 
if you listen to the people talking, the um, mm. the actors, of course, the major actors are people talking to the media. And everybody's like, oh, well, they get paid so much. Well, they are a very, very small uh, portion. portion of the people working in the industry. Um, and if you look at the lowest wages, they're oh, quite yeah. low. They're very low. And you look at the profits of the industry, um, which is quite large. Um, yeah, people people deserve a living wage. That was very close. Did you run into him? It looked like uh, I was him. one pixel away. And same with the writers as well. Everybody deserves um, to be able to... There we go. I triggered him. There we go. Ooh, this one is uh, not easy. Ugh, of course you're down there. Watch out. Okay, you come up this way. Good job. Um, I think it's going to drag on for a long time. Um, uh, I think so too. I read something very interesting about AI um, and about the use of people's likenesses. likenesses. Like they were talking about um, extras or background. Mm. Not called extras. Background actors. Yeah. And they were wanting to ooh, shoot through walls. Oh, that was too stupid. That was dumb, dumb, dumb. Oh, I can't get that. Ah, I can't get that. What is that doing there? Um, they were asking to scan in background characters' faces. So they could they could use them. They, so they can pay them once. Oh. And they will never work again. What? Because once they've got your face, they don't need you anymore. Well, they would pay you. Would they, they would, pay you for the use of your likeness? Yep. Yeah, very. But they wouldn't very actually little. work. Uh, no, they wouldn't work. Yeah, that's... Um, but I read something the other day that um, Jet Li was supposed to be... Oh my god, I wasn't looking. Hola, Vitoko. Jet Li was supposed to be in uh, The Matrix, the first Matrix sequel. Matrix really? Two. Um, but they wanted him to sign an agreement where they would capture his... Oh, they're fast. Oh my god! Where they would capture his movements. Really? And be able to mo use them forever. And his Whoa, likeness. Really? Like his martial arts. <gasps> and he was like, no, no this isn't yeah. happening. I need to work forever. Wow. If you capture my movements. And he, and, yeah. he, and he didn't do that. And he went to make Hero, which is a billion times better <laughs> the than Matrix the second too. Matrix. Yeah. Um, so you can see where that's going. And all of a sudden you have AI doing uh, facial expressions and even manipulating somebody's look of their body and manipulating their their oh, movements so as well the standard hollywood rule screw the talent yep so once you have the likeness of somebody they're done you can use them forever if you get them to sign the right agreement so there people are like dismissing ai is like oh it's not a concern you're you're overblown no ai is where it is right now yeah imagine it in even a couple years it's going to be astounding and really really um really good and instead of being a tool for the industry to make things better they're making it worse for the the actors um it's going to be a little a little bit longer to replace writers, but it will get there. Technology moves forward more and more and more and more, at least for certain films. Like, they won't be innovative, but, you know, the ones that make the huge money really aren't that innovative to begin with. They're retreading things over and over again. We'll get that one. I didn't get that. Oh, it appeared outside of no, the realm. No, it was did there. I get it? I don't know if you got it, I don't but think it was I did. there. Um... Yeah, Crispin Glover also had um, oh, you can had that down. issue as well. I didn't know you could shoot um, down. For Back to the Future 2, where he didn't really? want to come back. And they're just like, okay, we're going to uh, use outtakes, and we're going to dress somebody up like you. And uh, he's like, no, I didn't sign did on. He sue, did he sue he them? He sued them successfully. Because he's like, I didn't sign on for Back to the Future 2. Who is that? You're, mm -hmm. you're making it out like it's me. And, and the other actor wore a face that looked like Crispin Glover. 
Really? So think of that and just make it into a computer that can digitally replace Crispin Glover's face. Uh, this game makes great use of the hardware. Very nicely done. Yeah, it it's really, really good. I can't move fast enough. <laughs> Uh, Gamma Dev says, Michael Crichton predicted this all the way back in 1981 for his film Looker, where the company paid perfect models to be scanned and used for as long as they lived. And then the studio decided to kill the woman to avoid paying. Mm. Wow. That's pretty good. Let's see if I can get... do better this time. I will, because I was, like, not paying attention to it. When I died a bunch of times. Oh my god. I almost died there. I know. I like the little interstitial where he walks across the screen to the next uh, mm. next bank, I guess. Yeah, I really love the gameplay in this. Ah! Oh, too early! I've done that. I've done oh, that. <laughs> you anticipate it because there's very yeah. little time to get through that. Yeah. Fun game. Super I like it. Fun. It's like a little puzzler and a little bit of an action puzzler. I like it. Yep. Um, I think I remember playing the first one, and where I got stuck was there's kind the, of the, the thing same at the top there. as last time. Yeah. Where they got fast, and then I was just like, oh, oh boy, I just died. Yeah. And when that's it goes where I blue, died. it's when it's uh, when it turns blue. When this, the background goes blue, it uh, when there's you go speed. up a level. Yeah. Oh, uh, that's the problem. And then you have one less uh, shot too. Ugh. According to. I'm gonna kill this guy. Three lives, yay! Yeah. Yeah, the AI thing is very interesting. Yep. Oh my god. Oh, I remember last time you shooting. Shooting uh, down is really hard. Yeah, because they're wiggly. I guess. Oh, oh I should go down and shoot that guy. No. Yes, please. Thank you. Well, it's nice it gives you a life. Do occasionally get one. Yeah. Oof. Oh, you have to be I, right against it. I know it. you have to time that. That uh, one's hard. That's the pattern I want. The guys kind of, kind of could look like a stormtrooper, and James is shooting just as accurately. <laughs> what? Insulting. Yeah, pretty much. Yeah, you really have to take your time on. Um, those lasers. Oh, so stinky. So stinky. If in the Star Wars series people are actually good shots, um, over it quick. would completely <laughs> negate the need for lightsabers. So. Yeah. I will take that. Thank you. Very generous with the plus ones this time. Yeah. Very that's, nice. That's good. Shim okay. down. Down. Over there. Stinky. Smells. Skunky. skunky. Like skunk skunk. Could be skunk skunk, could be mm, someone's really bad stinky pot. Weed. That'd be stinky weed. Yeah, probably is a skunk. Yeah. Poor skunk. Yeah. Someone terrified of skunk. Yep. Mm. I'll just run for it. I think this is a level where they go really fast. Oh, no. Uh, uh, no. Okay. Until they turn blue. Last time on that, I'm just gonna lead him away. Ugh. Come on out. There you go. Where's the guy gonna appear? There he is. Oh, that's not bad. Left the other guy behind. Bye bye. <laughs> <laughs> so, wait, so there's wait. a heist game as in the first game for the 2600? Yeah, it's it's like this. Um, yeah. Pretty much exactly like this. This is kind of an extension with different uh, mazes. Oh, this is a bonus level. Did it, did it, did it, did it. Oh, you got an extra. I know of a ColecoVision game called The Heist. I think it's completely different. 
Can I shoot in this level? Ooh. Unlimited bullets! Yeah, Ooh, you have no I, bullets there yet. Can I go down here? I can't get past the wall. No, criminals allowed! That'd be terrible if I made it past and I, then it, I couldn't get back up. No, too small. Oh my god! Oh, you're back at the beginning. Ah, okay. Yeah. Except faster. I wonder if the time goes down faster. Ugh, come on out. Out! Oh! They move fast. Oh, come on. Gonna run out of time. Still on faster, though. Run, 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 run! Yay! Whoa. You steal paintings in the CV game while avoiding room traps and have to find uh, keys. keys to unlock. So, similar Your time's, your time's... Oh, yeah, that's right. Be careful. Oh, God. Ah! Nope, one left. Oh, I knew it. I knew it. I'll have more time now. What? It went through his flicker. Ooh. Because there was two guys in the line and my bullet went through his flicker. Ooh. Damn you, flicker. Only such a thing existed in the real world. Yeah. I just, I'm just going to oh, turn my it. flicker on and then I can go invisible. No. Oh. It's hard when you hit when you hit blue. My microphone. I, I do have um, heist for Coleco. I'm gonna do better. We're gonna do one more time. Are you? Yep. Flickering is stealth suits. Yep. They have special suits. Oh, I can never time it. I get. You have to so... go immediately. It's not immediately. I have to just mentally time it right. Mm. That's my problem. There we go. Come and get me. Stealth suits, yes. Yep, they do have stealth suits. Only activated when they get near each other. Yeah, there's very little room for error in um, in the lasers. You have to go right up against oh, them and go boom very immediately. Close. Yeah. Got to play on a system with no lag. <laughs> you won't have. The reaction time. Oh, he was a sitting duck. How dare you? Mm. Run! He's a sneaky one. He was hiding. Ah. Hiding in the barrels. Come on, you. Well, I guess you can tell mm. what level you're on by the, the amount of score you have, because it's $1,000 per dollar sum. much. I was like, oh, what level am I on? See, now you completed completed level four. Uh, run. What if you if you die on a level after getting the money, does the money reappear or does the door stay open? Oh, I'm no. never fast enough. You I gotta, have to pause. I, I shoot, have to kill them. I shoot everyone on this level before I do that. I think you're right. I think you are correct. Um, Tim, question, if you get the dollar and die, I guess we'll find out maybe, nope, uh, does, the, does the dollar reappear or does the door stay open? Because that way you can get a thousand, thousand, thousand and it wouldn't really correspond with what level you're on. He can go through the laser, but your bullets can't go through the laser. Mm. So you have to really time it. Is there 10 levels and then the speed increases and then there's another 10? Is that what it is? If you die, you don't get the money and the door doesn't stay open. You restart the level. Score does respond, correspond to the level. Okay.
the laser. <laughs> so the the money doesn't reappear, but you still need to make it out. Door doesn't stay open. If you don't get the money and the door doesn't stay open, you restart the level. Score does does correspond. Oh, you shot up. Okay. Yeah, I did. You can do it. So that just means you don't get the score for the money because the money does reappear. Whew. Randomly firing guns seems like a dangerous way to target a bank vault. But yeah, only, uh, you know, those those guys are invulnerable. They don't get hit by the bank bullet. As far as I know. Oh, move, move. Oops. You just run. Run for it! Run! Like it was a gun aimed. <laughs> ah, see? It is. Ah! Uh, right away! Yeah, that killed me the first time, hey, too. Why am I not shooting? Because you have to move in a direction first. Oh my goodness! And dead. And dead! <laughs> okay, your turn. Uh, you made it halfway. I did make it to the blue. Yep. <laughs> there we go. Yes. I shot downward. Little breeze. Oh, little breeze. Little breeze. Oh. Uh, you can still feel the heat coming off the. No. No, it's not hot. Can you no, touch it, it isn't actually. Touch no, it. it's not hot. No. Um. No. Not no. really. Not really. Not like you know. Neon real, would be hot, right? Real neon. I don't know if neon's all that hot, but. I mean, probably. it's it's electrifying gas. So I don't think it would be hot. I mean, it's emitting it's emit emitting radi radiation, so it could I'm be sure hot. the power supply for it would be hot. It does emit a radiation. Well, radiation is yeah. light, right? So some sure. aspect of it might be. Electrons warm. are coming off of it. Well, right? electrons are being shot through through it to electrify it. To, the neon uh, or excite the, it. Whichever gas is there. Oh God. Why? I remember that from uh, a display at the um, Science and Technology Museum in Ottawa when I was growing up. Yeah. They had a big display of shooting Shoot, electricity, shooting electricity through, through um, what is it, the halon, halon, halon gases, oh, I got... whatever. I think Allergens? you're only offered an extra life if you're down a life. Very generous, though. And different gases um, oh, I have it. different colors. Have different colors. Yeah. yeah. I always love that. It's so cool. It is cool. Oh my god. Good job. Thank you. Very I need a, I need a life. I need a plus one. Very fast. I need a plus one. Uh oh. Wasting bullets. Wasting the bullets. You can shoot through it too. Uh, if you hit the, la I saw that one of us hit a laser with our bullet, oh. and it disappears. So oh. there is. Oh, maybe maybe you can just if it's disappeared at the time you shoot yes. it. Yes. Yeah. Come on, energize. Ooh, extra life. Yes, please. So generous. Thank you. Shoot down. Ooh, yeah. I got her. If you so time it right, it's yeah, just hard. It's not it is easy. hard. This looks like my kind of game. Oh, it, yep. this is great. I love this type of game. This is I do my agree. Type what game. is it? I do agree. Nostalgic. I don't know what nostalgic is. That sudden transition criminal screen is to the. Yeah. Um, oh. Once you learn the particulars, you can beat all 20 levels to become a master criminal. Master criminal. Nice. So, TX, Marsh says. Yep. No! Oh. I what hear in my head the um, impossible mission z z z z z z z noise yes. when you hit that laser. Oh, yeah, yeah, God. there you go. <laughs> that was so dumb. Two in a row. There we go. Come on down. I need a plus one. I need two plus ones before it gets too hard. Please give me one on this level. Please. Please, Tim. That guy doesn't really matter after, after a while. <gasps> oh, no! Too close! Playing again. Playing again. 
playing again. Sorry. Runner says, so interesting how the bullet changes color depending on what is across from it horizontally. Oh, yeah. It's common with the Atari games. It is. Oh, well, did you start over? Yes. Oh. I was did terrible. You got zapped. Rage reset. Wow, well, it didn't reset. Rage restart. Rage replay. <laughs> yeah. Doodly doodly hey, doodly doodly doodly. Where's your black uh, fluffy? Oh, he's over in the corner. Hi. Yeah, is he chilling? Keep he's, it cool. He's just like this, looking like a little black bunny rabbit. Oh. Hey, hey, bunny cat. It's a bunny cat. You're just, you're just biding your time for more treats, eh? <laughs> more treats, please. If you would give me more treats, I will yeah. take the treats. I think we need to buy them more catnip too. Yeah. Very low on the catnip. It doesn't go away as quick as other things, though. No, they don't eat oh as much. Oh my god, that was so close. Oh god, no! Ooh, so lucky. Very lucky. Mm -hmm. oh. Have to kill all the guys. Yeah, this one definitely benefits from only having one at the end to deal with. Uh, actually, better to go That's down, stinky. too. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it is because he's up top, so that's a, a good tactic, actually. Would you guys make good bank robbers? No. Well, mm -hmm. I don't know. Oh, damn it! Depends on the type of bank robbery. I don't yeah. think I could walk Stealthy into a one? bank and, yes. and, like, threaten a person. I just couldn't do it. No. Um, if it was, like, figuring out heist. how to get through, like, a heist, like break into the vault? Yeah, maybe not so bad. Yeah. I'd be good at planning it, maybe. Oh. Maybe not doing it. Yeah. <laughs> well, I could do it, but I just wouldn't want to, like... I'd be good at recruiting people. In inter yeah. <laughs> yeah. I'd find the right James people. James would be, be the recruiter. <laughs> yeah. Get yeah. the right people for the job. I would be all about, like, coming up with the plan, writing the spreadsheets. The spreadsheet. <laughs> who is doing what? <laughs> the spreadsheets for the heist. Accounting, who gets paid. You know that big board they have in all always, the heist there's movies? Always, I guarantee you, if there is a bank heist, someone has a spreadsheet somewhere. <laughs> so we got to get keep track of who's getting paid what and uh, yeah. and where everybody's going to hide out. And where someone you hide. has to tally up the costs for like well, the guns, yeah. Yeah, the there's instruments, expenses. There's expenses. the lock picks. You know, the, the, the stethoscope thing you need yep, to put up against it. the drill if you need it. Exactly. So. There's there's a lot of logistics to work out. I could do that. <laughs> um, so you wouldn't shoot as many guards in, re in a real heist as in this game. Not likely, no. I <laughs> can't see oh, myself. no, no, no. No, no killing. No. Come down here. Next level. Yeah. Oh this my gosh, they're so fast. Gotta be on your toes on level 10. Yeah. Gotta get to Master Criminal James. Oh, they're all blocked. <laughs> oh, they move so fast. Ah, how many bullets do you have left? Uh, one more. One more, but I don't Oh need boy. <laughs> Maybe I should have shot him. Target the kneecaps yes, if you must shoot. Right. <laughs> Criminal training game. Yeah. I don't know how. How accurate this is to real life. <laughs> okay, let's shoot you because oh, he's stuck. There we go. Run, 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 run. Okay, level 12, 13. Hard to tell. Come down. I think it's 13. What are you doing? Oh, good. Okay. It's like these guys up their game, eh? Oh, my God. Ooh, shoot him! Oh, I'm getting shoot stuck! Him. No! Oh. Up. Oh, 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 oh you're going to lose them all. Oh, no, you only have one left. Oh, no! No more shots! Stealth time. Run, 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 run. Oh, boy. Straight down. Oh, you oh, need that extra bullet. You, you can't do. miss. You can't miss on no. this. Nope. He's, he's 
caught in that hor corner. Oh, that's yeah. Okay. He will get caught down. Oh, good job. <sighs> it's brutal. Brutal. Nicely done. Yes, nicely done. <sighs> uh, Don't like this one. It's gonna, it's gonna... Door's screwed. Oh, I just wasted a bullet. Did you? It's yep. really hard to shoot down. Run. No. Uh, Going down is better for that guy because he gets caught on the corner. Yeah. Crime yeah. does pay. <laughs> Gotta kill this guy in a straight. Can't waste bullets. So I'm gonna go down, right? Yeah, see, he oh gets caught. God. And then you just run. Oh, okay. Yeah. Whoa, 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 whoa. A couple more levels to go. Good job. Trigger this guy? No. This guy, I'll shoot this guy. through this. Just gotta get out. Oh, do you Yay. have less time on this level too? It seems like it, but I don't know if that's true. This is a hard one to probably do in time. You just got your head taken off there. Oh, I can shoot down. Nope. Now I'm really dead. Yeah, you have to kind of... Last life. Oh, uh, there's an extra life. Get that first. Yep. Get it. And then okay, this guy. I, I think you just out. want to draw him out really fast. Yep. Uh, <gasps> Good job. Good job. Extra life, too. Good job. Uh, uh. <laughs> uh. TX Marsh one says, "Wow, I think it took me longer to get this good, and I programmed it." <laughs> <laughs> James likes this game. I, I like this. This is game. right up his alley. Yeah, this is just the type of game I like. So, oh, thank goodness this guy gets stuck. A oh. couple more to go, or one more? I Two don't more. know. Gotta get Master Criminal. Ooh, this is a tough one. Ooh. Okay, I'm gonna kill this guy. Yeah, don't shoot down. He takes so long to come up. Yes, you can't touch the walls, Tex Rich. Yeah, if you could not touch the walls, oh my god, it'd be a nightmare. Oh boy, oh boy, he's coming. Oh! Get out. Last level, I think. I think you're right. Yep. Master Criminal! Woo! Dance, 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 dance. <laughs> Good job. Got it. Good job, cats. Dance on the last screen. Let's dance. Let's go down here and walk around. And we escape with all the money. Yay! Woo! Yes! Good job! G G G G. Good game. So fun! Yes. Oh my goodness, Tim, you did a great job on that game. Cat burglar. <laughs> cat burglar, meow. Are you cat burglar? Thank oh, you to TX Marsh. <laughs> if you want to try and be a master criminal, you can. You can download this in the Atari Age forums and see if you can make it to all 20 levels. Yes. It uh, It's challenging, especially with the one last oh, yeah. bullet and the double speed. Oh my goodness. Okay, one last game. It is play? Peril by... Are going to play some Peril? VHZC. Is he going to play some Peril? This is his 20... He's so mad at me, sorry. <laughs> He's giving me the back ears. Mm, put me down. This is uh, VHZC's 21st game, wow. I think. Wow! He has made Aroach in Space, Aroach in Space 2, Cosmic Boogaloo, Canonica, Canon and D, D for Defense, Do Re Mi, Draco, Game of the Bear, Game of the Bear, Too Much to Bear, I Ran, Keep Them Out, Night Guy in Low Res Roll Castle Days, Night Guy on Board, 30 Squares of Fate, Night Guy Quest for Something, Low Res Car, Low Res Racer, Night Guy, Ninjish Guy in Low Res World, Ninjish Guy in Perilous Island, Oh No More Peril, that's when we're playing, uh, Ooze of the Goo Gaiden, Ooze of the Goo Maze Quest, Peril, Slide Boy in Maze Land. Some of those are for multiple systems yeah so it's kind of more than 21 yeah 21. Independent, independent titles, titles i guess yeah, yeah. Are you not 
this cat is being so Ready. cute. So he says, hi guys, I wanted to share my new game. Oh, no more peril. It's kind of a sequel to peril, but with some more different <laughs> mechanics. This time there's no boss fight, but you have to go through maze-like robotic factory and rescue the trapped workers Ooh. before your helicopter runs out of gas. Nice, 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 nice. Your final score is defined by the remaining fuel in your chopper and the number of workers rescued. This is the first beta, but it's also kind of release candidate because it can be considered done content-wise. Mm -hmm. Game has 40 screens, and some of them have to be visited more than once. Standard for VHZC. Mm -hmm. As usual, testing and feedback will be greatly appreciated. So here we go. Very excited about a new VHZC game. This was released yesterday. It is a uh, 32K game. And yesterday, day before. It was on the edge of midnight, I think. Oh no, more apparel! <laughs> Another play on words. Gorgeous. Um, Candy corn colors. <laughs> yeah. You picked the right direction, by the way. Did I? Yes. It was random at this point. Going to the right will lead you down a very path that it will take forever to get back. I can't remember oh. if you can touch the sides. I no. no. <laughs> so on this one, you cannot touch the sides. Yes. Thirty-two k. So much space. Holy heck! Nice sign. Yes, we just got it. Yeah, friends. It's the first <laughs> show with the new sign. Um. Actually, the lighting's not bad. The color and the signs coming through. Yeah, I don't we're think lit it's up bad at pretty all. Pretty good. The lighting will be much better. I'm getting a new light um, in a couple days. Just didn't arrive for the show, unfortunately. Let's move. You can go through it. It's lots of time. Yeah, the candy corn colors. Oh, I can't shoot, can I? No, not yet. Just like in peril, you have to go get your bullets first. Of course, there's lightning. There's a little different. There's guys in this one that you have to rescue, so that's a, that's a little different. There's your bullets. Is that what it is? It's an A. Ammo? Ammo. There you go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Nine nice. bullets. sounds good yep. or the sounds I sounds. should say oh. sound effects VHZC is um, amazing he does all his own music his own sounds his own graphics his own programming I love it TX Marsh agree great looking game VH that he is a master and he has the awards to prove it. Yes. <laughs> All right, I'm assuming there was nothing at the other end. No, there wasn't. No, so that's I have to go back. Dead end. Yeah. I think you cleared out all this I did. area. I did. I think. I did. Did you? Did you? I did. did, you? I did. You did. I did. Oh, there's more ammo again. But you only used one. So I think you're probably safe. Hopefully, you don't have to come back. But. Never know. Oof, skating by there. Oof. Oof! Almost hit the wall. I don't know how the hot lives work in this. You're I dead. think it might be just. Oh my god, so close. Might be just time. Ding, 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 ding. So the movements almost make a song up. Ooh, risky. But you made it. Oh my goodness. The program in this game is amazing. Hey, VHZC is in the chat. Reminds me of the Neon on Moonbeam Arcade. Yeah, I've, I've wanted this for a long, long time. Um, I didn't think I'd be ever be able to get one this big, though. <laughs> this is about as big as it gets. It pretty much takes up the whole back end. Ooh, yeah, get lower. <laughs> it's not that bad. That no, one's it's slow. pretty slow. Some of the other ones are a lot. It's 
Yeah, with VHZC games, yeah, VH games, you want to kind of pause when you come to a new level because it's like, oh, what's happening? Where does it go? Where's the danger? Where's mm. the safe spaces? This is a safe space right above the middle. <clears throat> Point. Yep. <clears throat> Just enough time. Ah, too fast. Too fast. Am I dead? Nope. 137 fuel left. Oof. Seven bullets. And so it's two paths you can go. It's one gonna be the hard the... one and one the easy it's one. It's definitely going to be the hard one. Oh, no, oh, that does clear. Okay, I thought that was going to be a constant. Oh, that was close. game might be like a race against time. It's like you have to move. Oh, another dude to rescue. Did it say how many guys there were to rescue? Um, let's see. No, it doesn't say how many. So we've got two so far. Stompy. Stompy neighbors. That was a dead end above? You made it yeah. all the way to the end? Okay. Oh! <gasps> That's why you pause. Yep. Yeah, VHZC is <clears throat> amazing for variety. Every single screen is something different. And it behaves differently. He hasn't shown his pawn yet. I wonder if he'll do a pawn. So far it doesn't had like moving, free moving things. That looks like oh my God. the symbol for there's a Commodore company, like a homebrew company that has that symbol. What is it? It's very cool. You can kill the guys, but it's penalized with 100 units of fuel. Don't kill the guys. Oh my god. Someone left to right. Okay. Oh my goodness. Oh, I'm running into walls. Terrible. <clears throat> A little hard to follow the gameplay, but the programming is so advanced. I think we've just played so many VHZC games that we just know what we're doing. Just the mechanics. <laughs> the mechanics of it, yeah. There's no boss in this one, he says, so... Oh, what gosh, are you what doing, doing at the bottom? Get... Oh, oh! What are you doing? Ah! You were right about that, though. <laughs> oh, boy. Ah! Wait to see where it's going Wait first. Wait to see the pattern. Down, up, down. I'm going to have to go through that Goodness. a couple times. Builds and yeah, there's another dude to rescue. Oh my goodness. Run out of time. Nope. nope. Is that where I want to go? Yeah. Didn't I come from that? No. I'm Something confused. different. No, you've never seen this. It's just similar to something else. Thank you. That was not, that was... Another guy. 
got another guy. Good stuff. It's fairly linear. <gasps> ah! Oh, I panicked. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, my God. So close. Oh, oh. It's actually pretty easy to outrun that guy. TX Mark says, this is my favorite game of the night. <laughs> Including your own. <laughs> He's discounting his own. Ah! Oh! She, didn't, she didn't wait. Didn't wait. Ooh, nice. Very Mega Man-esque. Things move across the screen and then rebuild on the other side. Very nice. Oh, there's the Pong! Yeah. We got the Pong now. Always gotta have a Pong. It's better to be on top or bottom with that oh. one. Another thing to shoot. Ah, opening door closed. That's nice. Oh, another dude. Run, dude, run! You have 150. One minute, 50? Mm, what? Back where you came, back where Ooh, you came. I must have missed a alternate path. Ugh. Erratic, erratic flying. <laughs> Texture says, I like how the game remembers where you came from in a screen after you crash, so you can't cheat and start on the right side if you came in from the left side. <laughs> It's oh, so yeah. Silly. Oh, you don't have much time left. Panicking. Panic. Oh, panic cats. Where was the uh, split off of the Oh, path? way back. Oh, no. Yeah. It's here, right? I yeah. Think... Yeah. And I think you made the right decision I don't know. which direction you went. I think I did. right back. Really? Wow. Or I screwed it up, which is possible. I'm sure I can... No! Oh no. I'm so confused now. Oh no. 84 left. I'm just confused. I can't. You want to visit us? Just getting sloppy now. Yep. Panicking. Oh. <laughs> I'm just all. Not the right place to pause. Yeah. All messed up. So it's not like a regular pattern, it's doing zigzags. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> dive the into wall. the ground! I know you're gonna die one way or the other, so. Oh my god. Wow. Just okay, enough I'm room. I'm super confused now. Well, you have to go back to that path that uh, splits off. <clears throat> Up there. There you go. Still backtracking now. Not yeah. Getting anywhere new yet. I like how you paused after. Deadly. I'm not gonna make it, but that's okay. Nope. Covered an awful lot of it. Oh yeah, I think you're really close. Like, Ugh, I think I this backtracking close, is. But I've, uh, I think this backtracking is like uh, the end. I don't know what this is. I find this pattern really like messes me up for some reason. Yeah, done. Fuel zero. Pretty good though. Nice screen Pretty clearing. Pretty good. Question mark? Oh no, that's smoke. Good. Let's do this. Yeah, I like how the game remembers where you came from in a screen after you crash, so you can't cheat oh, and start yeah. on the other side. Yeah. It's a hallmark of VHZC as well. Yep. It's the right thing to do, too. Such a variety in hazards. Yep, yep, yep. Uh, 
That's a good game. I love these games. Mm-hmm. Every VHC game is similar, but very different yeah. at the same time. Yeah. So you know kind of how it works, but you're not prepared for the new puzzles that he, uh, he gives you. And I think you definitely have enough bullets to get through with a couple to spare, yeah. I think. I don't know how many guys you have to get, so... Well, it's more like walls you have to break down. <gasps> That was a great, great run. You it guys was. are getting better and better with my games. <laughs> <laughs> I think we're 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 uh, we played enough of them now. Yeah. <laughs> I still get panicky though. Yeah. Sometimes I'm like, ah, ah, it's coming to get me. Oh. Oh, right into. You don't really lose any time. Right into the lasers. When you die, especially if you just started the level. I think it just keeps counting. Oops. Yeah, 606. Yeah, or I didn't know about this until just now, but just played through it. Very cool to see how he combines the different puzzles he makes from the other games and refines them for each new game. Yep. They get better and better and cleaner. Um, and just d totally different. Like, you yeah. can manipulate the things he's already used into different forms so that they are different in the new game. Mm -hmm. Oh, what? Fire got me. TX Marsh One says this is the kind of game I would have stayed up all night to beat back in 1980. Oh. Yep. Oh yeah. 100. Oh my god. What am I doing? Stop crashing into the walls, kitten. Stop crashing. Shoot. Oops. What am I doing? I don't have unlimited shots. Oh my god! I'm being playing so sloppily. Yeah, you, you have to be on your game when you're playing a VH said C game. No, do, do so, no. Oh, yeah, you can pause there. Yeah. You can get through it, though. Yeah, you, you just did. have to go. Yeah. Comes back. Something about those pointy ones seems oh, extra perilous. Yeah. I. No different than the hammer coming down or the fist, but just something they're they're pointier. Yeah, they're they always would there do you too. do you more damage. It's moving and you can see it yeah. like not disappearing. It's somehow more menacing. It's <clears throat> cute, I like that. Super cute. Reminds me of that robot game that you have to control with the Yes, magnets. the 7800 game. Yeah. Oops. Dumb. Do you lose time when you die? I always look too late. I uh, sure you do, but... Or does it just, like, you just have to start the level over? That magnet one was kind of tricky, and you have to react fast. Mm, yeah. You can do the top first, right? I think you did the top and it was fine. Yes, the top, yeah. I didn't, yeah, I checked to see if you lost time. Uh, no, you don't. No, no. Good. you just have to do it. <laughs> do it again. Do it again. So it's not a big loss. It's meant to be achievable. Yeah. I don't think there's, yeah, I think that's Dead. it. Opens like after you complete a. Oh my god, I didn't expect that. Um, nothing opens extra like you're like you were backtracking to who knows where. Do you no, have to go I, back I to knew the... where it was, but I it was quite a ways back, and I think maybe I should have gone down the other path. Oh, so first. I'll show you, I think, where the break off path okay. was because there was a to the left and a down, and I went to the left, and I think I probably should have gone down first. I don't know. Maybe that's not possible. Yeah, here. So I went to the left instead of down. Okay. I believe. Yeah. Well, we'll see. Hopefully this is a dead end. There was something here. Yeah, I didn't get that guy. 
So maybe I should have gotten that guy first. Mm. Maybe. Maybe. It looks like there's something to the there's left still there, more. too. Yeah. yeah. What, is anyway. the, what does ITC say? Uh, wait, I just realized I didn't see any skulls in this. VH said, see, you still got a screen to be added with some skulls, <laughs> right? That is a trademark of yours. <laughs> How about that? Oh, look at that. Oh, middle. Yeah. So, well, middle right, middle left, left. It's just, it's the patterns are meant to confuse your brain. Oh, press. Ooh, ooh. Oh, it's timed. Okay. Ooh, just barely you can do it. And you have to get around it, too. Oh, okay. Not too bad. Not too bad. I hope this is not the end. Oh, my God. Oh, you've been here? Nope. You've that was the to... other one I went through that you didn't go through. Oh. One way or the other, you have to backtrack. True. Sure. I swear you went through this, but you didn't see nope. that skull. Nope. Whoa, not my this. God. What's happening? Oh, my God. Anything Middle. Good? Yeah. Oh, no. Yeah, it's there. safe. There. They're safe. No. Nope. Oh my god, now no, we're it's safe. Not. The far left is safe. Yeah, okay. the far left. There. Oh boy. This has got to be the end, though. I don't know, maybe it is. Maybe I did do it the right way. <laughs> Feels like that's the end. <gasps> yeah, these are really hard, so. This feels like an end. Uh, VHC, I left no skulls, lava, nor bats. I left some things oh. out. Oh, oh there's boy. a guy up there. <sighs> that is tight. Have to go through the bottom. No, it goes up and down. It goes up, down, so you want to get it on the up, I think. Okay. No, no. Sorry. It doesn't matter. Do you just do you? <laughs> I know how I would do it. Goes up, then down. Up, then down. There you go. Just have to pick one and time it. This is harder. Yeah, this is a much harder area. I think this is the end. Love how each room sounds different. God yeah. Damn. Back. Uh, what? Okay. Ah! <laughs> Didn't get you. Didn't get you. I know there's a safe spot in each of these. So. Oh my god, it went too early. Something presses it down. Oh, it went too early again. Relax. Relax, kittens. It's hard. You gotta you gotta be calm when you're playing a VHZ game. Yep. There you go. Oh, I can make it cut. Oh, this is the end. That's the end. Missed I missed a, a bunch. A bunch of them. So that's well done, not, not, not what you do. Yeah. yeah. Do it again. I have to do it again. The three is the rescued guys. So we know which way to go this time. But now we know the down is the is the end. So. The end. So don't go there yet. Go to left. You get infinite lives. It's time. Yeah. Yeah. So your score. It's more about the score at the end and making yes. it in time. And to getting the end. a bunch of the guys because you completed yeah. it, but for sure we didn't get them all. No. So. Yeah. Score and that score is based on time. Bonus time for each guy you get. So it adds more. You get bonus time? Yep, it added an extra ah, bonus time. But you also got some. That's why it has four score digits. Score as well. Yeah, it adds the fuel gotcha. to, the, to the guys. No, I don't, no bonus time. No, you get extra score. At the score, end yeah, not each. bonus time. Well, it's fuel slash time. Slash score. No, no, that's score. You don't. There was no increase in fuel when you got that guy. No, no, no. At the end of the game, I meant. When I made it to the end of the game, it added mm. extra. <clears throat> uh, 
But he's done that in a bunch of his recent games, is uses the timer as the score, so it double does double duty, which is mm -hmm. genius. So I'm gonna have to use um I'm gonna have to use a bar. Yeah, I like that. Yeah. VHZC says the sound effects are made increasing and decreasing the volume, and in some cases using the X or Y position of the enemies as value for notes. Oh, well that's smart. Yeah, that's very cool. Extra time. I kind of some of these now. Once you've done them. It a little yeah. bit easier. <laughs> Sometimes not thinking is the best strategy too. Yeah, just, just doing it. relaxing and going on instinct. Yeah. If you think too hard, that's when you run into stuff. Yeah. Yeah, that's nice. Mm -hmm. Little zappies. Picking up a package. Yes, they have a pleasing, dynamic range of volume. Yes. So we go up first. And this one. Yeah. And then there's another one down there. Oof. It's close. Get him. Come here. Get him. Go bubbles, which look harder than they are. Yeah. Very impressive bubbles. Oh my. Yep. Oh my god. I tried to make it look like I'm using more elements per screen than I and than I am actually using. It is a standard DB kernel, two sprites, two missile wind ball. Mm. Oops. Yeah, it's it's super impressive. Yeah. And like that lightning going from left to right. Thank you for subscribing, oh, Captain Man 2D. Yeah. Um, TX Marsh one gifted a tier one sub to Captain Man 2D. Oh wow! Thank, Thank you, you so TX much. Marsh. like something I can't it's, it's a C64 company so it's so left you first. can go left yeah so down is obviously the way out yeah so this is where you have to backtrack to yeah try to remember how to get there it's, yeah. it's just right into the sea high run run fly fly Fly, little bird. This one messes me up for some reason. Because oh, it, a lot of his puzzles look more devious yes. than they are. They're like, oh, <laughs> they overwhelm you. Yeah, right? that's true. So you have to get up so to there. Yes, yes. And you almost made How it How do back. you get back up? Yeah, you have to go back through there. Okay. Switch first, left or right. Oh, I don't think it matters. No, I think you have to do both, right? Yeah. Oh, that guy's in the middle, and I think you get the middle guy going through yeah. here. Yeah. You have to go through. Ah! No. <laughs> hey, come here. Yeah, I wasted too much time on those. You can, if you're higher up, you can, he does go kind of around you. Yeah. Yeah. Left. And there's left, and then you go back. Backtrack. Yeah. We'll make it. We'll make it. I haven't wasted too much. Oh my god. Yeah. I haven't wasted too much time yet. Three, four, up. Two, two three, three, four. One, two, three, four. <laughs> bouncy, 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 bouncy. Bong, bong, bong. Oops. Didn't know who was going to go that far. Over. Top of the bottom. Yes. Come here. Come here. Nope. Oh, and then you backtrack. And what you're seeing there is the end. Yep. 
Little bit of backtracking on this. Oh my oh. god. Pong. Deadly pong balls. Very deadly. They're always deadly. Very good design on the balls always. Ooh, I think I have to go through the top. Maybe not. I think it's better to oh, uh, right there. Right? Yeah. Just have to don't hit the don't hit the wall. There you go. <clears throat> and then up through there. There, yep. Three forty-eight, still good. Okay. One thing I like about these games too is even though we play it, when you play it, when you pick up a copy and play it, you won't remember any of this. <laughs> no, because there's so much. <laughs> there's so much. Almost no, almost, almost in the middle. Oh, God. I think I need to be on the bottom, maybe. Stop it! Stop it! Yeah, because if you're, if you're at the bottom, you have to go out through the bottom. Go to the bottom. Yeah. It comes up and you yeah, just run right past it. Yeah, much easier to yeah. the bottom when going back. And now you go down. Yeah. And is that all of them? Race to the end. So there's a guy up there. Boom, get that guy. Get that guy. Get that guy. Great animation on the guys, too. They look really good for, like, such a small character. Another one where it looks crazy, but it's really not. <laughs> that's, that's the design of the I like, I like the, the, the gargoyle head, though. Good job. I like how there's another one that uh, helps you go back, but you don't need to go back. Maybe. Maybe you get to the end and go, hey, I'm missing a guy. I need to well, go back and see if true, I can get the last one. But this would be the bad way to do it. Okay, this is this is the trickiest screen, I think. Yeah, agreed. Okay, I've got the pattern now. Yeah, okay. <laughs> once you know it. Oh, I don't think I started fast enough. Oh, Ooh. just barely. I'm not sure. You just need to get it on. It oh, goes down. It goes, it goes up down. and down. Yeah. That's what makes it tricky. Now. Yeah. There you go. Yeah. 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 Oh, I'm going to follow behind this guy. Go, 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 go. Yeah, I guess you can go through the bottom, but it seems harder. It seems harder, doesn't it? Yeah. I uh, wasted a turn. Oh, stupid. Stupid. Didn't that wait. That is a great room. Yeah, RC70. That is the boss room, if there ever was a boss room. Stop it! Why are you... You just gotta pause. I just... It can't I, get you there. <laughs> I just think it's done when it's pushed through, just pause. but it's not. It's not, no. <laughs> just too excited. This is it. Da, da, da. So five men. Five men. Seven. ITC thought there was six. Did I miss one? He thought there was six? Yeah. Or there are six? I don't know. I don't know. Feet at sea, how many are there? How many are there? Seven seventy one. New world record. <laughs> New house record. New televised record. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Live record. There you go. Thank you, Vitoko. Yep. You got the normal good ending. Oh, is there a bad ending? <laughs> well, the last one I did was a bad ending because I didn't get all the guys. Right? Oh, I yeah. got the smoke, smoke. No, that's when that you die. That was you die. No, There's no, a six no. guy. Damn it. Where? You have to shoot a wall Maybe. that you don't even know that you can shoot? Maybe. It's hidden. Oh, no. No. Mm -hmm. I'll leave that to ITC. <laughs> he likes he likes finding the hidden stuff. I'm terrible at finding Easter eggs yeah. and hidden things like there's probably some wall that's like that looks out of place. Like yeah. there's something. Or a maybe we out of just place. passed by a, a by a point no, that we could have gone back to. Don't it's possible. think so. Yeah. Anyway. So maybe ITC did get a sixth guy. That, yeah. Uh, that, that would we didn't make sense. See. Yeah. Um, 
awesome, awesome as usual. So good. So very good. Yep. That's amazing. Hi. Um, so coming up on the show, uh, like I announced at the top of the show, Hi. Hi. next episode, we will be talking about homebrew on the Atari VCS 800. And we will be interviewing Dionoid, uh, Dion, yep. uh, uh, Dion Allsthorn, about his games on the VCS. Mm -hmm. And talking about the process of getting his game uh, and talking to Atari and looking at the uh, what's going on with the you know emulation and how it all works. Um, so it'll be an interesting show. Thank you, Leandro, for following. Yes, thank you for following. Um, and we get to try out this Yay! system I'm as excited. well and play the uh, exclusive 2600 homebrew that's actually 2600. Nice. Um, and hopefully it'll be on cartridge or released as a, a ROM. RC70 would like to order one of these signs from the local shop. <laughs> are, you, are, you, are you local, RC70? Yeah. <laughs> uh, if you are, then you can. Um, uh, what was the name of the company? It was Night, Night Glow. So if you're in Vancouver, yeah. you can order from Night Glow. Or you can very get your affordable. own sign made because they, they, um, they take your uh, designs like this design so yeah so i designed yeah. this and sent it to them uh i don't know if they ship they delivered locally yeah um i signed this size kind of local delivery might be more it cuts yeah. down on cost <laughs> it is a nice sign though yeah very it's nice very sign. nice sign yeah uh where's oh, bernie we haven't figured out what to do with all our little doodads yet so we'll figure that out yeah, yeah. right now we're putting the atari 2600 at whatever system yeah. we're playing on bernie the... might go over there we'll find some spots yeah they might decorate this area yeah I don't know, because this is big, and yeah. it took up the whole wall. Yeah. Which, it's very nice looking, mm -hmm. but it does uh, does take up everything. Yeah. Um, if you're in the U.S., I probably wouldn't order a sign from Canada. <laughs> I'd probably order one from the U.S. Yeah. Because you're going to play it, pay import and stuff. Did you give them the rights to distribute the design? James was not thinking about that. <laughs> no, of course not. I did not give him the rights. <laughs> <laughs> I retain the rights for Zero Page Homebrew. Yeah. Uh, I gave them rights to uh, make my sign. Yeah. <laughs> I didn't sign anything, actually. They just made the sign. Yeah, yeah. there you go. Uh, great games today. Oh, actually, um, yeah. So we're going to play uh, Atari VCS 800 Homebrew Special with live interview with Dion Osthorn. Noon Friday, Darcy will be here. Make sure you don't want to miss... You don't want to miss that because mm -hmm. um, we'll be talking all about homebrew. Atari 2600 and 7800 homebrew. Bob mm -hmm. DiCrescenzo has his 7800 game failsafe on this. Nice. There's two exclusive games on that system nice. that are actual 2600 games um, that are nowhere else. That's why I bought it. Um, I was forced to buy it mm -hmm. because that's what I do. Homebrew mm -hmm. on Atari systems. And so I had to do it. Um, so we'll talk about uh, how to get your game on there, how your game works on there, the look of it, um, et cetera, et cetera. Mm -hmm. um, and then after that, we'll probably be doing a 7800 show. There's a game called Drelbs that I really want to play. Um, it might or might be Jaguar, depending if I can find some more 7800 games to play. Mm -hmm. There's a whole bunch of 2600 games that have been released recently. Uh, we played a bunch of them today, and there's still more, like uh, Laserface Island, Laserface Planet, Domino, Twisty Passages, Fruit Fly Fun. Wow. Um, so I kind of have a bunch to do. Um, we also, coming up, have the, a 7800 Game Drive special mm -hmm. with a live interview with Saint, James Bolton, of Retro HQ. We're going to go through everything to do with Homebrew and the 7800 Game Drive. Oh, wow. I know that, um, what's that other show? Retro RGB. Mm -hmm. That is all about RGB. They yeah. did, they covered the RGB side of it. Gotcha. Like the connections and the look of it. Yeah. So we're going to cover the homebrew aspect to it. Nice. What nice. runs on it and um, just top to bottom, everything about the 7800 game drive. Um, so we will see that. Yes, and Blockum Sockum isn't work in progress. It's done. Oh, I did update it on the list. I just didn't update it here. On this so one. There you go. I will update that. Yeah. Uh, um, John told me that it wasn't work in progress, and I changed it on 
John Hancock. Um, Immortal Jan John Hancock. That's his game. Gotcha. Um, I changed on this Jaguar list, but obviously I didn't change it there, so that's my nice. fault. Uh, yeah, and we have some Lynx games to play, so I'm slowly filling those out now that we're back and going, but I definitely have a whole probably other two shows of 2600 games coming up. Um, but I think 7800 will be the next one after the interview with Dion Olsthorn. So, lots of fun. Mm -hmm. um, yes, the 7800 game drive um, has RGB out, mm -hmm. comes with a controller connection that you can connect right uh, up to it. Mm -hmm. um, has support for BUP, oh, what's it called now? BUP drive? BUP drive? BUP, BUP something? Audio format. Mm -hmm. um, it's a pretty much catch all. So if you miss the Dragonfly, you'll want to get this. It's nice. pre orders, and it's for pre order in a lot of the stores now, okay. online stores. None of them have shipped that I know of. No, okay. He's still waiting to hear uh, somebody get one yet. Okay. Uh, Saint, he just posted today. Any, I'm waiting for somebody to get one. Ah. Yeah. Um, so that'll be fun. So I don't know the date on that. It really is dictated when he can get me one because he kind of wants to make sure everything's good. That it's it. working properly. Yeah. Yeah, because right now he's releasing a very small run of them. Gotcha. And just make sure it's it everything works properly because he doesn't want to demonstrate one that kind of has janky things. That's I'm sure fair. there's. <laughs> it's all done with firmware updates and stuff. Uh, yeah, so thank you for hanging out of our, uh, with our first show back. I've been uh, missing the show. It's lots of fun. Yeah. Of course, we were sick, so well, I couldn't wait to show this off yeah, as well. We yeah, hung this, this, hung this last night because yeah. two days ago we had a show and this wasn't up. Yeah. Uh, went up pretty good. Yeah, actually pretty easily. Only one of the pins we had to like hammer over a bit. Oh, it, it, it was, was pretty good. Yeah. 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 And, uh. Yep. I'm just totally impressed. And because it's on this clear acrylic, pulls it away from the wall. So it kind of, kind of gives this glow against the back of the wall. Yeah. Like it just has such a Miami feel to it. I love it. Oh. Oh, there's the flashing one. Yeah. It's a little distracting. Yeah. It's like you can see it in a, <laughs> a peripheral. There you go. And you can pick the colors. Yeah, the glitchy, the glitchy one, yeah. That's nice. And it cycles. Come on. Do your thing. It's cycling. It kind of cycles and then it stops. It's cycling. No, you have to... There we go, now it's flashing again. The, the, the switching between modes so doesn't weird. quite work properly sometimes. It's very strange. But and the color changing works really well. And you can pick all the colors. Yeah. We're and having fun. You can <laughs> make it go dim. Anyway, there we go. Really, really fun. Yay! Um, thank you for tuning in, RC70, Metal Lunar, Hugh Jazz, Gamma Dev, Mark Yohannes, Cyrano, a reboot, TX Marsh. Gamma uh, Dev. And thank you, TX Marsh, uh, Leandro Camera, for your games. Yes. And VHZC. Uh, and VHZC awesome. as well. Uh, Vitoko, yeah. RC70, Dan, ABC. Um, uh, Oh, Ooh, Prow nice. 7. Prow 7. Yeah. Uh, Ivory Tower Collections. Hey, Jesse. Um, text Rich. Arena Foot. Te tested and rocking. <laughs> tested and working. Uh, who else? Who else? Who else? Who else? Scrolling through the names. Rendered Ghost. Uh, Kiki PDPH, thank you so much for letting us premiere a uh, meow, meow two. two. Will there be a meow three? Only time will tell. More cat games. Conan will make it next time. Who's Conan? <laughs> Who is Conan? Are you talking about Darcy? Erlen? Erlen? <laughs> Don't know which one's Conan. <laughs> Uh, thanks for showing my game. I missed the other games. I'll check them out later. All great games. Oh, today. Conan! It's just no Brian joke. There oh, you go. Oh, funny. Yeah. yeah, we played Intruders. We'll him next time. Meow two, Heist two, and Oh No More Peril. All of them, awesome. Mm -hmm. So good. Yeah, Conan and Brian's awesome. He's a funny guy. We like Conan. Yeah, watch his uh, 
clips anyway. Clips from his podcast. Podcasts. Oh, I listen to his podcast too. Do you? Oh, yeah, okay. I do. Yeah, his, the, my, the people he has on his show are so yeah. good. Oh, he's so funny. Um, so we will be back. We're regular. We're doing regular times again. Yep. It'll be Friday at noon with Darcy. We're doing the Atari VACS 800 homebrew special mm -hmm. with all the 2600 and 7800 homebrew live with Dion Olsthorn. It'll be lots of fun. The Clueless Gamer. Those were so frustrating to watch. <laughs> he is terrible at playing video <laughs> games. Like, really terrible. Uh, yeah, really bad. But if you haven't seen that, go for it. <laughs> he did play a 2600 game. A couple of did 20, he? Yeah, he played oh, some 2600 okay. games. Okay. It's probably why a lot of these people know about that segment of it. Yeah. But he played some more modern games mm. for the time. Um, yep, that's it. We're done for the night. Have a great week. Yep. And uh, we will see you on Friday. Yep. Um, so have a great week. Bye, everyone. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.